All right, everyone, good morning. We are back with another live stream. It's Monday, so we're going to be doing some more career challenges here in Grand Theft Auto. Exciting stuff or potentially super boring. This is how we're going to make it more exciting is doing a live stream because doing this stuff by yourself, absolutely, it's a grind. It's a grind and a half, you know? A lot of this stuff I have done like off stream, but this is why we're dedicating Mondays, probably Tuesdays, Wednesdays, Thursdays, Fridays, Saturdays, and Sundays now just to getting this crap done, seriously. So right now we are in a closed crew session. We're working on hangar obviously still which is uh just basically resupplying doing cell missions not that fancy it just it is what it is so i did i did we got a thumbnail and everything going and we're just gonna be doing this for a bit what's up killer yeah i still need to text you my address i think man i've been lagging on that Every single time I see you, I remember that. But then every single time I look at my phone, I forget how to forget to text you. <laughs> I like I barely use my phone, dude. Like nobody, nobody ever calls me like anymore. I used to be at like one point in my life, dude. My phone used to pop off like every freaking two seconds or something like that. Now it's just like notifications on videos and things like that. So I don't really check it as much, you know, it's just because it's just notifications for like people's uh, channels that I'm like subscribed to. I'll be like, eh, I'll watch that video later. Another Monday. Let me tell you what it looks outside my house right now. Dude, it is dark. It is, it is, it looks like a thunder, a thunderstorm is about to happen. Maybe not lightning, maybe not lightning, but definitely probably some thunder. 1000% uh, chance of rain. That's for sure. We're just waking up. Yep, closed crew session. Anybody wants to come in here and help your best friend gravesite grind this? You can do that. Not you, though, Killa. You you got to work on that barn for your truck. <laughs> They'll build a barn warehouse. So you got a, a mechanics place or something. You got to put a nice lock on it, too, so nobody gets in there, right? Well, it almost sounds like a nice place to go to. Think about this. For like a like a man cave, you got you got music, right? You got tools and you got like freaking an engine or something like that to work on. Dude, what what else could what else could you ask for besides for some beers probably, right? I'm just setting up the stream right now. We're just setting this up. Just got to set this up. Mid midstream, gotta set it up. Oh, I hate this challenge too. So this is what one of my friends told me is for okay. So for the thousand crates that you have to sell, that doesn't have to be your crates. So at some point, I was thinking about just like getting out of a party or something like that and just asking people, hey, do you do you need help selling selling your hanger? <laughs> Everybody just not want to do money glitches these days. Like nobody even wants to play the game crazy all right we're heading to the the talk page now it's where i can talk to you there we go there, there's some people Oh, uh, we can do another one of those tomorrow. Uh, we'll do a modded car thing tomorrow because I haven't done one of those in a minute. And honestly, I'm going to let you know, I've been, I've been playing a lot of other games lately. Because I just got that one new game. And we would be doing that right now. But obviously, dude, there's only like two people watching yesterday. So I think I'll just play that game without showing everyone else. Because <laughs> it's actually like I, I found out a whole bunch of new things about the game that are actually pretty cool like upgrades and other things that i can do and powers that i get but you know just not a lot of people like games like that i do though i like lots of different games but it is monday and we got scheduled this bull crap all right let's run down here and talk to rooster real quick because i don't i don't care about the crates necessarily i mean i kind of do but i kind of don't i mean at one point we're gonna have to go after some money here but at right now we're just i'm just gonna do this just so we can fill this one up the fastest right now potentially 
Yep, closed crew session, by the way, I believe. So if anybody ends up wanting to roll through, they, they uh, can. But that just means that you're just going to probably be hanging out or help or helping me get the hangar stuff. But hey, it is GTA, and everybody loves 11-year-old games. So nobody likes new games. They just like the 11-year-old ones. Like, there was a game that I was playing on PC. It was like, it's like older than GTA right now, but it's actually a really fun game. We're, so we're sourcing. Should we get the, should we get some drugs? Kind of want, I kind of want some drugs. <laughs> land. We're doing the land. Please give me an easy one. You ready? Okay. I'm ready. Wait, Hackachu Drag? We can't do this with the Hackachu Drag. Anyways, hopefully everybody's doing good, having a good Monday. Apparently, I'm, I'm getting myself to some messed up sleep hours again because I just woke up at like 6 o'clock in the afternoon. Yeah, I was asleep all day. Why? What was I doing all night? Take a guess. It had something to do with video games and me playing them. Yeah, that's the luxury of my life, though. What you need, boss? Some wheels? I can bring them around. I'll bring it to you. That's why we've mapped it out. We've mapped it out at this point to where this is what I get to do. This is career choice. I'm going to be doing this for a long time now. Even even after GTA 6, I'll still be YouTubing. That's That's 100%. That is that is a fact right there, friends. I'm gonna be a YouTuber for probably a good. Wait, let's see. How old am I now? Another, another 50 years. I'm gonna be a YouTuber for another 50 years at least. So get get ready for lots of videos in the next 50 years. You see how most YouTubers they just quit? Not me. I don't think I'm ever gonna quit. I'm gonna get an award for being the the, the longest oldest YouTuber at some point. Someone that's been YouTubing for the last 50 years. That's how much I love it. Hell, in 50 years, I'll come back and play some more GTA 5, huh? 50-year <laughs> anniversary. See this comedy that I just come up with inside my mind. Am I talking to you or am I talking to myself? All right, what now, Ron? What do we gotta do here? It's like up here. Wait, where? What? This is like the garage area. Am I even in the right spot? Oh, it's over here. No, it's not there. It's like it's like over here. You have to find a little box to shoot. Maybe. Where's the box? Be like a little box around here somewhere. Oh, it's a little kitty! Oh, little kitty! I'm gonna run you over with my Mark II. Ah! <laughs> hey! I was just killing, some, slaying some pussy over there. <laughs> Woo! Don't call me a puto. I'm looking for the stupid box I gotta shoot. Where is it? Maybe I'm going too fast here and my eyes aren't adjusting. I got horrible vision. Seriously, I gotta open my eyes up and not blink. Dude, where is it, man? Where's the box? Wait, is that it right there? That's it right there, right? Okay, that's not it. <laughs> I did I did see a box though. I did see a box. Dude, who the hell is shooting at me? You want some of this? Get the old Mark II missile flying at you. I think it was a female too. I almost feel bad, but I don't. I don't see it. Is it hiding back here? So that's it right there then. Okay, so that is it then. Because I, I looked over here and I was like, wait a minute. Now open up the door. 
Give me my box. Yeah, narcotics. All right. Should I take this back to the hangar? Should we just take this back to my house, huh? 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 <laughs> and we're going back to the old house. We're going to open up it like a Christmas present. See what's inside here. What kind of narcotics did we get? Is it a weekend of coke or a whole month of meth? <laughs> just kidding. Just kidding. It is GTA though. Come on now. Back to the hangar. By the way, we're in a closed crew session. Anybody feels like joining up and hanging out? We can do this. If not, it's just me doing this right now for the next couple hours. I'm, like my friends right now are playing Daisy. They want me to go play Daisy. <sighs> We got, dude, we got so griefed over in that game. It's like, it didn't even make me want to go back and play anymore. Like, that's how much, like, I, I don't know, dude. Like, I just get, I get tired of these type of players that, like, you can, you can do certain things, but, like, going to the extra extent of just trying to be in, just be a complete a-hole, that's like a, a, a mental something on your part. You know what I'm saying? Like... Like, I, I, I would almost wonder, like, people that do that, how many friends that they have in real life compared to, like, you know, online friends and stuff. And Sorry about that, buddy. Yeah, the main thing that we're playing right now is day is DayZ, dude. I'm telling you, it's pretty fun. You don't have to get it. It was on sale for like 30 bucks. It's like an expensive game too, right? Now, dude, they still Dude, how old is DayZ? And they want $50 for that game still. Like still. Like still. Are you kidding me? I didn't pay that. I paid like 20 bucks. I bought it off of Amazon. I bought the disc. I haven't bought dude, I haven't bought a disc for a video game in in forever. Forever. All right, should we get some more? Let's get some more. I don't care what it is. We just have we just have to get this stuff. This is like part of the challenge that I have to do anyway. So, man, I gotta go get some water too. Dang it, freaking thirsty. I usually try to set myself up before live streams. I use like a little snack, get myself a little half a sandwich, get a, a couple bottles of water, grab some weed. <laughs> Hey! How's it going, buddy? Guess what game I'm playing? GTA. Alright, just had to yell at somebody in my house to go get me some waters. So I don't have to go do it. I'm sitting down right now, you know? Can you open that up? For, open one of these up for me. Open one up, please. I, I got one hand. The other hand is playing a video game. Okay? Who can play one with a controller with one hand? I can. Look at me go. Woo! You can go left and right and everything. This is all one, one hand, dude. Wait, which one do we have to do? Please don't tell me this is the Alamo C one. Oh my god, it is! Why does it give you these crap missions, dude? Like, F you, Rockstar. Because they know. Dude, I'm... Ah. There, you know there's people over there pulling strings. You know this is a thing. Yeah, sure, dude. Make me go all the way out into Polito Bay again. Yeah, we'll do it. We're going to do a give cars to friends thing tomorrow, I believe. I got videos to make uh, after after this. Yeah, I play, I've been playing like uh, Rise of Ronin all last night. Like, I just I just turned off the stream because there was only like two people watching. And I was like, yeah, that's that's awesome. Hell, I'd get I'd get more people watching me on Twitch. <laughs> like I don't even live stream on Twitch anymore. I could still I can still live stream on Twitch. Hey, at least Twitch will let me cuss. YouTube doesn't even let me cuss. That's why you guys like never hear me cuss or I'll or I'll, I'll filter my cussing 
I will filter it. I'll be like, what the f is that? I'll bleep, I bleep out my own cussing. This is something that I've learnt, learnt to do. So I'm gonna cuss so bad. Dude, it's GTA. Does anybody hear that? The hell was that, man? Tell me it's somebody else heard that. Oh my god, I think I'm freaking out. This is a stupid one, too. Ugh. It's gonna make me go all the way out to the ocean here and grab. I've done this a thousand times, if not a thousand more. Maybe we should have chose a different one to work on. Dude, I just want to run into a bird. You, I don't think you're ever gonna run into a bird, dude. When they're flying, I think they're transparent. I, I'm almost, I'm almost certain of it. I'm pretty sure the birds are transparent when you're flying through the air. Unless you're going like super slow or something. Otherwise, I think that I don't know, because I flew through a couple and they're like they're transparent. Like there's a bird over there. All right, well, here's the truck. So maybe we should just leave that there, or no, I'm gonna need, damn it. All right, I got an idea. We're gonna leave the Mark II there, and we're gonna take the Sparrow out here. Because if I destroy the Sparrow, I don't have to call Morris Mutual. And it's got infinite missiles. So guess who's about to get lit up? These dudes. Target spotted. This is uh, AKGI 24. Coming in. Coming in hot. Yeah. Infinite missiles. Is it a glitch? It's not a glitch. Dude, I'm going to chop you up with my blade. You watch. I'm coming for you. Oh, there's nobody there. It's just the boat. I thought there was somebody there. Come on, man. No. Yeah, see? So I just drowned it out. It's cool. We're good. Let's get in the old submarine. Oh, I got to press the button. Do I got to press the button? I don't have to press the button, do I? No? Okay, we're good. No, we do got to press the button. It's the button to release the... Oh, my God. I knew there was a button I had to press. Good Get up there, dude. How is this thing even floating? What is it? I don't know. Apparently, it's a boat. Oh, there's the button. The magic button. Huh. Maybe next time I take the submarine and I just park it under that thing. I'm going to do that next time. I'm going to take the submarine first and I'm going to park it under that thing. So so when I hit the button, it just lands on top. Did you see that fish looking at me a little bit wrong? You're lucky I'm on a mission right now, fish. I'd get right out of this submarine with my diver's knife. Chop you up something. I'll, I will fire you up on a grill right up on the beach. I'll find a stick. First, you got to clean... The you gotta clean them and scale them, though. You gotta scale. You can't just eat a fish. You gotta scale it. Oh, I hate scaling fishes and cleaning them. Can the game stop freaking like dropping FPS or mini freezing? Hey, we got ourselves a a, a sunset, I believe. That is a sunset in the horizon, and a Kim trail. Big old Kim trail in the sky. Buzzer keeps shooting at me. Look at this dude. It wants me to go all the way all the way into the city with this submarine. All the way into the city with the submarine. Woo! Hold on, let's do that again. What wait for it? Woo! <laughs> no, I haven't been drinking, as a matter of fact. I don't drink. I usually don't. Not only on special special occasions or, or bad occasions.
There it is. We're getting close to it, fellas. I got one box. Nothing's going to stop me except for the beach right here. Oh, God. Do you see how the game is, like, freaking freezing? What's going on here? Cockstar. Everybody calls them that, too. Be like, yeah, but they make good games. I don't understand why people talk so much crap about, you know, the company that they... No, get get out. Hold on. What, what should we use here? Minigun? Where is he? I in the sky. Channel 7 News. You're done. Part of Weasel News reporting to you live that this helicopter is going down. Oh, you didn't die? Okay, they did die. They're still, still shitting at me. Let's see, what should we use for this thing? What do we, what do we got? Uh, we got one of these. Use one of those. If that helps. Let's see the snowball. Oh, taser. Oh. I only have one of those. Oh, we got two. Three. All right. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Wait just a damn minute here. Can I get back there? Hold on. We're just going to do one. Ah! Give me. I just got beat up. Oh, so I just freaking got the back open. I didn't even, I didn't even. Oh my God, you're so dead. Okay, move, move Mark II. Move Mark II. Might want to stand back for this. We've we got missiles. We'll just use the missiles on the Mark II. There it is. Yeah, all that for one crate. Woo! <laughs> one crate. Polito Bay. Ten minutes. Let's go. Exciting stuff. By the way, we're in a closed crew session. Anybody feels like hang hanging out with the green alien? Let's do this. Let's get more than one crate. <laughs> if you had three people helping you, this could go so quick. It, it, it goes so quick with three people helping you. So that's all we need. We just need three people. Three randoms. Come on in here. Career challenge Monday. 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 Well, there's a city about five minutes away. Better get some popcorn and something to drink. You see what I, you, do you see what I'm talking about, though? I don't know. Yeah, I guess it's kind of relaxing in a sense. Playing GTA. Some aspects. You, like when you're not in a public session. Not having to deal with people's BS. I've noticed, I've noticed this, too, dude. From, like, okay, like the last ten years of gaming... Like, let's just say 10 years ago, GTA, everybody, 90% of the community was on their microphones all the time. Now, it's complete opposite. You have maybe 10% of the community that's on their microphones. And the mo and the 10%, they're like the super toxic people too. Because these are people that really want to engage in somebody else in, in dialect and, you know... Yeah, I was just reaching up to scratch my nose, and then I noticed that I just shaved yesterday, and now I gotta shave again or something because I got this five o'clock shadow stuff coming in, and my 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 upper lip right now feels like a freaking cat's tongue. Girlfriends always hate that. <laughs> For basically, your your whole face feels like a, a cat's tongue. <laughs> You touch it, it hurts, feels like sandpaper. You're like, ow. You ever see one of those old Western movies where you could strike a, they, they used to strike a match like on their face? I've never tried it, but I would like to sometime. I wanted to try that sometime. I'll just get like some five o'clock shadow stuff going on and then I'll just take like one of those good matches and just be like, Shh. it just feels like, hopefully I wouldn't light my face on fire. <laughs> Gamers! I'm on the Mark II Oppressor. Do you think this thing's going to be in GTA 6? Hopefully, God, hope not. It's a god-awful game. 
Yeah, anybody feels like playing? We're on PS5. Closed crew session. Doing hangar missions. This is basically what it is. It wants you to sell a thousand of these. You'd have to do a thousand. I did a thousand sell missions. <laughs> I only sold one crate at a time. But it wanted me to take the one crate and drop it off in ten different spots. It's like, what? It'll make you do that too. I swear to God. I sold like two crates one time and it was like ten spots. And I was like, for two, for two crates? How are we doing this? We're chopping the crate up or something. Here we go. We're coming in hot. We're going to do a crash landing here. Crash landing, coming in. Don't shoot that. Get ready. Jump. Ow, okay, I didn't do it. I gotta slow down. My bad. I could have I could have murdered myself. There's that there's those cam trails or whatever they're Kim or Cam. Cam Brady, O twelve. <laughs> yes! Yes! We got another one done! Can you believe this? Now I have like two. I should take that jet next time if it's out in Polito Bay, dude. The jet would be so much faster. Can I just get a Pegasus vehicle, too, I think? I could just get, like, a Pegasus vehicle. It'd probably be quicker, right? Like, at least a laser. If I have to go out there again, dude, I'm getting a Pegasus vehicle. I'm not using the Mark II. Because that's the heart of rock and roll. Chemicals? Ooh, more narcotics. We got some more narcos going on. Land. I'm doing the land. So this should be easy. All right, Ron, where do you want me to go this time, huh? We're calling Pegasus. We're going to need something good here. Hello, Pegasus Lifestyle Management. How can I help you? Helicopter, where's the plane at? Screw it, let's go with the laser. Thank you, sir. Your We're going laser. Aircraft is now ready for you at our nearest airfield. Wait a minute, where is it? Oh, it's right, <laughs> it's right here. You know, people ask me that too, like all the time. They go, dude, if you, if you can't see or hear like barely at all, how are you even playing games? I don't know, you ever see that paraplegic kid that freaking only plays with like blowing into a freaking straw? Because humans are amazing and we're capable of amazing things. We're also capable of horrible things. Woo! Let's do some loop to loops. Hey, let's fly upside down in the city. Let's go. Let's make this live stream a little bit funner than it is. Don't crash. Hey. Talk, don't jinx you just jinx me probably now I'm gonna crash because you said that oh. Oh. I'm not gonna crash I'm an ace pilot look at this I can do all the tricks I don't know. Flying upside down is pretty fun, though. I would say, like, if you fly upside down for long enough, it's like, it... I don't know. It's weird. Wait, where are we even have to go, anyways? Now we're just... Now we're just flying around. Sandy? We're going to Sandy? Alright, here we go. Now we're on course. 
Now we're on course. Set and start date, track. 9507-29 to the 420. Yep, 420 is coming up here soon in GTA. I wonder what they're going to do this year. Give us more marijuana stuff. How about a bong for a melee weapon? Just like what Jimmy had. All right, what do we do here? Are we landing? What do we do here? Let me know. Are we landing or are we crashing? Do you want me to land it? I'll land it. Do you want me to land it? Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, he's in grape seed. Look at my can't leave cam trail. Now, supposedly, those are chemicals that the government is dumping way up in the air to spread down to the populace. Mind control. To make people go fucking crazy. That's why everybody's crazy, supposedly, because of the chemtrails. Dude, the game is like freezing or something now for some reason. They've done something in the game that's like making it freeze like every so often. Oh, oh. We're good, we're good. Oh, there you go. I was just looking for a place to land it. Apparently in a, in a bumpy cornfield that's getting planted. What do we do here? Should we sneak? We're going stealth in GTA. Dun, 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 dun. Ah! Oh, they see me! They... Wait, I don't... Hold on! I'm not in auto-aim! I'm in free-aim! Oh my god, I'm in free-aim. I forgot because I was doing something yesterday. Okay, let's just switch to... Uh... Where's this stupid helicopter? Ah! I got shot in the face! Dude, this is ridiculous. Come on now, why would I do this to myself? Are you serious? I can't even pause the game. I don't even know what I'm thinking. All right, we just got to find the box and get out of here. I'm in free aim. We got to change that. Headshot. Where's the box? Somebody help me find it. I'm freaking out here. Is this it? Is this somewhere over here? Here's the wing. I found a wing. We got a wing. Mmm, chicken wings do, does sound good. Fried chicken wings. Do you see the game is like freezing now, dude? It's been doing this ever since they freaking Cluckenbell update, whatever. Where is it? We're just getting a truck here and we're just getting one of these bad boys. Look for it. With the lights and everything. That's it right there? Is that it? That's not it. Oh, check this out though. They got one of these new helicopters here. Yeah, that's the new one. Huh. I didn't realize that. You could probably do like the give cars to friends thing. It's dark. I can barely see. I'm getting shot at. I'm looking for a stupid crate. Dude, fine. If I can hop in this helicopter, I'm just going to do it, man. Can I? I can? What? Oh, it's stupid. It fires like the freaking buzzer, dude. Look at that. Two missiles? Look at the side of this thing. It's packed jam full of freaking rockets. Do you see something like that on the Sparrow helicopter? I don't think that you do, okay? I don't think that, that, that that's a thing. That's not a thing. Where is it? Oh wait, I think that's it right there. Oh, I got horrible vision. I got it. We're going back to the laser though. Screw that thing. Run! 
Run back to the laser. Don't fucking call me, Ron. What are you doing? I'm in the middle of a high pursuit chase. Freaking get a telephone call from Ron. I'm going to shoot his house on the way back. That's a promise, Ron! Oh, get the bird! Get, get the bird. We're out of here. We did it. Bingo, bango. Now, where does he live? Right over here, right? Right next to the trailer? Trevor? Trevor's trailer? Like right there somewhere? Right in there. I got it. Don't worry. We got it. Don't worry. Woo! Hey, let's go to the prison. <laughs> yeah, how stupid is that, dude? There's a video game that I was playing, and, like, it's kind of like Skyrim or something like that in a sense, too. There's, like, an RPG or something on PC. But, like, so you go into the castle. You punch a guard. You know what happens to you? Like, eventually, a whole bunch of guards show up, and they're like, you're going to jail. <laughs> that's that's sad that they actually put a prison in GTA, but they didn't freaking, like, do anything with it to where players at any point for mouthing off or anything like that. Dude, you should get boat kicked into prison if you're, like, being toxic in GTA. I always thought that would be awesome. Instead of, like, vote kicking players out of the lobby, why don't you just vote kick them into prison? Dude, that would like probably make you shut up because then you got to spend your days in prison or something. You got a court date and everything. Depending on your offense. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We're going down. We're going down. Jump. Dude, the engine just crapped out on me, man. I didn't even realize. That I lost my crap or not. Yeah, it's over here. Great, now how do we get there? The Sparrow Helicopter. This is it right here. By the way, anybody wants to come in here? PS5, close crew session. Monday career challenge. I bet you Rooster's back by now. I'm gonna just talk to him again. I don't care about the, like, not like this time right now. Maybe there'll be another time where I'll be going after, like, all one crate, but that that's when, like, I get, like, a group of people together. Yeah, where's all my people? I don't know. We don't know where they are. It's Monday. They're probably working, sleeping, decided not to play GTA anymore. Yeah, that's what Terp said, too. Terp, my friend Terp, he's, like, done with GTA. He's like, ever since the Acid Lab DLC, he's like, I was just like, I'm not feeling that game. I was like, I get it. I'm riding it till the wheels fall off, that's for sure. I always want to shoot that, you know? That will do it. Right into the circle! Hold on, let's see if Rooster's back. I think Rooster is back. Yes, no. Nope, not there. I gotta get close because I can't I can't tell. Sourcing more. Here we go. So four? We're gonna do all fifty today. We're doing all 50. We're gonna fill this booger up. Me and Rooster. That's fine. We'll do it too. Oh God, I hope I can fly this thing. Is the blade too close to the wall? Sketchy. Nope, nope, we got it. Well, the laser is gone. It's Pegasus though, so you don't have to like pay to, or pay to rep um, to repair it, whatever. Yeah, those Pegasus vehicles, definitely worth it, I would say. 
Uh, Buzzard Helicopter, year one. That was like probably your your best go-to vehicle. All right, where does he even want me to go this time? Let's see. The old pause menu. Please don't tell me it's like... Wait a minute, where's the yellow circle? Oh my god, no, I know this one. Okay. We're gonna have to we're going out into the freaking Uh oh. I think we're I think we're gonna crash. This thing's engine's gonna die. Do you hear it? Those are not those are not good noises. Uh oh. The engine just cut out. Okay, well look, if the engine's gonna die, we gotta get up high. This thing's a weakling too, dude. You smack it one one time. Dude, if I punch this thing, it'll start smoking. Seriously. Try that sometime. Punch a sparrow helicopter and see if it starts to smoke. It probably will. Uh-oh. Are we going down? I was like cutting off, man. This thing's definitely gonna die, like any time. Please just let me make it up over this sign. The Vinewood sign. Supposed to be Hollywood sign, but it's fine wood. Oh yeah, this thing's dying. Can we make it? Who's got money on this? Who's got money on this? I got I got fifty bucks, says <laughs> says I'm gonna make it. Says the helicopter is gonna make it. Not only gonna make it, we're gonna be able to touch down too. Uh oh. Uh oh, uh oh, no, no, she's still gone. She's still gone. Oh, look at this. Look at this, made it right there. Uh oh, I didn't realize we did a bunch of bad guys. Dude, how come someone didn't remind me I'm in freaking free aim? I need auto aim. Sorry for yelling, by the way. I died though, so. Something I like to do right before I die is just yell. <laughs> Alright, so. Maybe we just do this. One potato. There you go, headshot. See about this guy. A headshot. Oh, missed that for sure. What the hell? Hey man! What are you doing? Guy just got a tractor and started shooting it at me. How come I can't shoot that guy? Oh, that guy's dead. That guy's dead. That guy dead? Anybody else? Man, I'm gonna get this tractor and drive it over there. I eh, probably could have ran about as fast. Uh, man, I kind of want that freaking sparrow helicopter for this time, but we're just gonna do this. Yeah, give cars, do uh, trading modded cars is gonna be a live stream tomorrow. I'll try to wake up earlier. Once again, I'll probably be up all night. You like how I did that? Yeah, that, that's how I that's how I roll. I can't even see you. Oh god, I hate free aim. It's so horrible. Yeah. Okay. After I get this crate, I gotta go in and change it. We have to change this for sure, dude. Nobody's gonna want to go into free aim and play free aim. You you do it for like I well I do it for RP because you can get way more RP in free aim than you can than than any other. Where is he? Oh he's right! Oh he's up there! I didn't even see his up up there! Are you 
fucking kidding me. No way you just put me back on land. No way. Wait a minute. Hold on. Isn't this thing aquanized? Hold on. These are aquanized, aren't they? This thing right here? Isn't that aquanized? Okay, well, I just found out that, that that's not the aquanized one. There is like an aquanized one though, isn't there? Does, oh, it's got like the barrels on the side or something. Yeah, it's got the barrels on the side. It gives me another boat. Come on now. You want me to take the boat? I, I could take the boat. I guess we're taking the boat. We're getting the boat. Get in the boat. Here we go again. Ready? There we go. Don't tell me I'm stuck here. No! Why would you do that? Alright, screw it. All right, this time before I hit the button, I'm gonna take the submarine and I'm gonna put the submarine in the thing and see if the, the actual box is transparent or not and it just falls through the submarine or or whatnot. So let me... Did he die? Dude, I don't know, because I'm not getting RP for this. Sometimes you just gotta run up and melee him. <clears throat> All right, this is going to be a little bit time consuming, but we're going to do this anyways. Or just say screw it. We're just going to get the button. Uh, we're going to take this. So I really want to know. All right, we're going to have to take this and we've got to park this right under here. All right, let me know when we look good, you think. What do you think? Right about Ooh, right about here? Right about here. I hope I hope it doesn't float away though. Right about here, maybe? No, no, I'm way off. Hold on now. Damn it, dude. Because I'm in the water. It's like it's hard to control. I, I don't know if it'll stay like this, but I think right here is like decent. Maybe maybe a tiny bit forward. Like right there, what do you think? No, it's just like floating back. Whatever, dude, screw it. Let's get this mission done. I don't have patience for BS. Dude, I'm getting shot at too. I thought I killed everyone up there. Cause I don't have backup. Probably. I don't know where my backup is. Backup. Yeah, where's any? Where's all my crew members? <laughs> they don't show up for career challenges. <laughs> they just show up for <laughs> trading modded cars. Oh, oh yeah. Okay, my bad. <laughs> forgot about. <laughs> forgot about that one. <laughs> I, I'm not twisting anybody's twist twisting anybody's arm to Munson for this one. This is all me. Th these are just basically uh, solo, anyways. I wish it gave you the ability, kind of like the uh, the CEO thing or something like that, when you're going after CEO special crate. See, this thing wouldn't have even stayed there anyways, dude. So you'd need like two people here. You need someone to stay like in the submarine. Let's see if I can get this thing to dive down. Oh my god, it's dark down here. Oh, oh, it is scary dark down here. Dude, it's like pitch black down here. I got it. We got it. Why, why is he... Where do I have to take it? Way down here? Oh my god. 
What are we doing? We're taking like Trevor's Trevor's trailer or something. Too bad you can't shoot out of this thing. I'll shoot that helicopter down right now. Way down here. Yeah, I don't know if it wants you to like travel under or, like underwater because we are in like the submarine. Yeah, this is the submarine from the Kusatka. Whatever. <clears throat> uh oh. Rocks up ahead. shot at right now too like it actually wants you to take this vehicle and drive it all the way back that'd be horrible all right mission parameters take out the helicopter Got your pilot. We're gonna watch you crash now. Right in front of us! Front seat for you! Woo! <laughs> Gotta love that, huh? Get like an explosion right in front of you. Should we try to light it on fire? Fire's not working. I don't think smoke bombs are gonna work either. Uh, no rockets? Dude, what do we have? We got nothing here. All right, we're just going to call on the Mark II. Jumping on in five, Rick. Right on, buddy. <clears throat> yeah, I can. Uh, if you haven't sold those, I can help you sell. I'm, I'm in free game right now, so I got to get the heck out of free game. I don't know why I'm in free game. Because I was doing some stuff yesterday. I put myself in frame. Give me my package. Yeah, so that's the cool thing about this too. So whether whether you're helping yourself or helping a friend, you're still gonna get. Yeah, you're still gonna get like um, career progress. So that's pretty. That's pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. All the way back to the hangar, LSIA. And we have the nice, the nice houses over there. Those are the mansions back there that we never get to buy. Never got mansions. Maybe we'll get mansions in GTA 6. Maybe they're saving, saving it up. I can imagine us owning some mansions or something like that. You can't have that. That'd just be kind of weird, though, too. Because how are they going to make it to where, like, that's my mansion and not anybody else's mansion? So it just happens to be I'm in a public session and I'm going to my mansion, and it just happens to be that someone else owns that same mansion, you know? And then, like, you, you know, you're shooting each other or something in front of the mansion, and then you're like roommates. Now you got Now you're basically just sharing your mansion with like a whole bunch of other players. Just like kind of like what we do now, in a sense. I mean, kind of, but not really. Just saying. <laughs> All right, let's see if this time I can do it. All right, don't go too fast. Got to slow down just a little bit here. 
And jump. Nope, didn't get that one either. You can do it to where he just like, he just goes like right in, you know? Maybe I was going too fast again and I smacked up against the wall. Maybe Rooster's back by now. Yeah, right now I don't care for the th for the thousand crates that I have to sell. Don't, I don't care what they are. I gotta make money though too off of it. Nope, Rooster's not back. Those are chemicals right there. Hi. Here's a worker. What are you doing? Do I pay you to be on your? What are you? You playing a video game, aren't you? That'd be funny if you like looked at her phone and she was actually playing a game. She's probably looking at watching TikTok. Swiping. Swiping through shorts. Been doing that for the last three hours. Just getting that dopamine fix. Land, sea, or air? Hey, how come they don't have C? C, C, C? It's been a while since we asserted. All right, where does he want me to go now? Oh, that's not bad. Hey, that's in the city. Oh, I know this one. I know this one. This one's easy. I know this one. Why, why didn't anybody tell me to freaking fix my free aim? Oh my god, I'm still in free aim. What's wrong with me? I couldn't remember by the time I was in Sandy Shores to fix my free aim by the time that I got back. Because I totally spaced it out. Because <laughs> I'm a netball. <laughs> ah, what's wrong with me? I need to lay off the peyote. I've eaten so many peyote plants in this game. Thousands. You're gonna find this place. Going right in here. Dang it. Yeah, I hear you want fire down there. Burn. Yeah, I really got to get into uh, assisted aim here. This is horrible with the shooting. I want I want my character to automatically aim on people. You, you mean like aim bot? Yeah, something like that. That's what they do. That's what they gave like the NPCs. They gave the NPCs like aimbot, and some and some of it's like turned up really high, man. You can't even you can't even exist. Like they will just shoot you in the head. So that's why they toned it down the way that they did or whatever. They they have it like at a certain level, and then certain missions and certain other things in the game have it like turned up or either turned even more down. Get rid of that. All right, this time I'll change my settings here. All right, we got that done. Now let me change my settings. All right, here we go. Hey, if you're on the friends list, you're... You're one of the friends, right? That's why they have a friends list there. Is that you, Trevor? You got rocking the Trevor outfit. Yes, changed my targeting mode. Thank you. What, you can't stand a little free aim? I can. I used to play in free aim all the time, dude. For like a whole year, I used to play in free aim. Because you can drive in a car down the street without getting shot. Because all someone has to do is stand in a street corner with auto aim and like just kill everybody that's driving by with their auto aim. 
you know. Hey, man, wake up. Hey. What the hell, man? Get up. Grave? Do I have to... Oh, right there. I have to press something. <laughs> get up, man. You're embarrassing me. No, don't get back in bed. What are you doing? Get out of bed, dude. I'm spamming right on the D-pad. No, get out. <laughs> okay, it was triangle. My bad. All right, we're good. You're gonna have to send me a, C a CEO invite at some point here. Yeah, I think I sent you an invite into this uh, right. this party if you wanted to join it. Just gotta get that CEO invite. All right, let's sell some of this. What did he? What did he go after? Did he go after chemicals, or did you have to go after the drugs? It's either chemicals or narcotics. So if you have if you have one product, and it's all like narcotics or chemicals, those are the two right there that will actually give you a seventy percent bonus. So you should get a 70% bonus. And if you were to do this in a full public session, you're getting in almost, I think, 45% or 50% bonus on top of that. Now I'm pretty sure it's 50, 50% 50 bonus because when I sell my when I sell my freaking bunker uh, in a public session and it's a full public session, I can end up getting like 1.5 plus million, almost 1.6. So that's like literally 50% um, on top of the, the million dollars that you would normally get for taking the risk. What'd you go after, buddy? Did you go after the chemicals? Or did you go after the narcotics? Yeah, the thing about this, though, too, you gotta make sure you sell them through land. Makes it the easiest. Yeah, I think he's got a whole uh, 50 right now to sell. Yeah, that's what I was saying about the bonuses. So I had a bonus sheet up at one point that I posted, I think, in the community thing. And it was showing, um, you know, all the bonuses potentially that, that you would get for having. But it, it has to be, like, specific. It's either, like, uh, you know, and some of them are broken up, too. Like, you could have 25 of this and 25 of that. And you'd still get, like, a 30% possible, possible bonus. But it has to be nothing but, like, those specific two or something like that but it mainly comes down to just one one product at a time so and then of course there is a wait time of i think like four four minutes or something like that between between the the deals ready to go Let me make the sale associating Yeah, I thought I did join that. I am now an associate. Yeah, I thought I did join. It must have kicked me out of mine or something like that. I don't know if I was still in one. Whatever. I'm in it now. Oh, is your hang your hangers at the military base, huh? I was thinking about switching back here. This is where I got my this is where I got my Raja too, right in front. I love the Raja. It's a freaking. This is a really fun vehicle. I hope that they have something like this in GTA 6. You know, I don't know. Just the whole hovering, the hovering ability, the 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 other the other. I don't know. Yeah, so we're at the military base. It looks like. Waiting for you nearby. Just hitch it up and bring it to the drop off. That's it.
Hold on, my character's being very special. Get in, man! He just walks over there casually. Just struts over there. This is it? Just one? We just got one of these? Oh, I just got some RP. Some RP. That's it? This is it? One trailer? Yeah, let's see where we have to go though with it. To the city, I'm sure. I'm sure to the city. Sheesh. Okay, so let's see here. Your yeah, your best guess, dude. Just follow this road. Just follow the road. It'll, yeah, I was, I was gonna say because it'll take you all the way down here and then up and around. That's not. That's not that bad. No, I don't know about taking that way. Yeah, I take it. I take a. You okay? I'm trying to squeeze through that door. Take a left up. I would take a left up here if I were you. I wouldn't follow what that purple purple line says. I'd take a left up here. Yeah, take a left. I think it's going to be smooth sailing. I don't think there's going to be any bad guys that are chasing us necessarily. I mean, we haven't been getting shot at yet, so. I mean, some most of the time it seems like they'll throw like NPC in NPCs like chasing you or something like that. Usually like all the MC freaking cell missions, you always have like someone chasing you it seems like or I don't know, maybe not all of them, but I don't know. My my recollection is the fact that they they do they have a lot of NPCs that chase you sometimes. You should get a nice amount of money off of this. So if you're going for the, should we get like a 70% bonus? Uh, he said that his, um, I think he's going after all chemicals or all narcotics, something like that. I just know that those are the two that you can go after through, through, uh, through and through. And you can like, if you have all of them, you can get a 70% bonus on it. So that's why you'd want to potentially, if you were going to be running this and you were potentially going after the money, that's why like, if you have friends though, too, it goes a lot faster. I'm pretty I'm pretty sure you can have up to four people when you when you do this so it'd be like you and then three other people so it'd be like four crates potentially most of the time I, th I think I'm pretty sure on that one because we were doing it a while ago when we had a bunch of people helping me and I think the maximum that we could have in the CEO was like four people or something like that and, and we were able to get the get the maximum amount of crates which is uh it's a bit different than any other thing that with any other business in the game oh made that guy mad Yeah, it's just one shipment of goods. This should be uh, 50. So, career challenge located right in here in the businesses. Well, no, right here in the businesses. There it is. And this is it right here. Smuggler's Run. This is going to be the Smuggler's Run. And for the very last thing, you get like, you get one of these little things, I guess. But you can see some of these challenges right here. Yeah, and at some point it says right here you have to sell all types of air freight. So you'd have to sort. Or you just have Rooster do it, whatever, if you got the money. Like I got the money for it. I don't I don't care about the money. I'm just trying to get the challenge done. Then we've sort 70 74 out of a hundred. That's not bad either. I'll get that one done way before I get the uh the thousand. Yeah, and to get some money, uh, the the uh, 
the time after this, I'm gonna start going. At, I'm gonna stop paying Rooster to do it, and I'm gonna start going after a specific type so I can get the bonus. And I'm probably might think about doing it in a public session too, where I'm rocking like four plus million dollars on the sell. Damn, there you go. How much money did I make though? I didn't make very much money. And then that should have counted towards my career challenge possibly. So let's see if it did. I will go back in here. Uh, if it did, it didn't register yet. Hold on. It's gonna take. It's gonna take it a second. Hey, we're done. Didn't I say it would be easy? That that actually was pretty easy. Now I'm going to look real quick. Uh, let's, let's, let's see here. Businesses, smugglers run. No, it doesn't look like it counted, dude. That is a, that is a confirmed negative on that on on a no, or unless it's it's going to count it later or something, but it doesn't look like it did. No, that sucks. Excuse me. Oh, oh, no. So I just start beating people up on the street, stealing their money and their snacks. Hey, you just hit Mark to a preser, man. What are you doing? Well, at least we're in assisted aim now. Yeah, I don't think that that counted for mine. I don't know. I just, I don't think that that counted. It's supposed to, supposedly. But I can tell you guys this about the career challenges. Every single one of the career challenges that I've been dealing with, they're, they're all glitched. They're all glitched in one way or another. The Gerald ones, those are, those are way weird. Because when you complete the Gerald ones, they, they complete for like they're they got coded wrong. They got coded wrong, so like when you complete something, it's not for that job, it's for like for another job. And like I explained that in the, the video that I made on it too, because I completed it at one point and I was like, okay. So like this is for this, but then this is for that. Like everything's mixed up in there for the jobs and the for the career challenge. Like you'll beat something, it'll say what it is, but like it's not for that, it's for something completely different. Like for the Gerald stuff. Oh, the rat, man. Get the rat. Dude, there's freaking rats everywhere, man. Look at them. I can't shoot him. Oh, I got him. Oh, I got another one. Disgusting little creature. I got an idea. I'm making some ratatouille right, right now. <laughs> Yeah, dude, I don't think that, that 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 worked. Let me look one more time and see if it's registered. Nope. Still says 204 out of 1000. Yeah, but you have to you have to make 50 million doing that too. So that that has to be like methodical because how how are you going to make 50 million? Like even if you did 1000, that still doesn't mean that you're going to make 50 million off doing like a random whatever because you're only getting paid for every 50 you're only getting paid 1.5 if it's just if it, if they're just random crates yeah you're only getting paid like 1.5 million that's why that one would probably be a bit more challenging all right back to the uh yeah and i don't know if it works with other people's that's the thing though too well... Alright, 
was trying to get to my sparrow here. Yeah, I can imagine the last one too that I'd be doing is probably the OG, uh, the OG heist. That's why, I like, dude, I want to. I'm gonna start doing some more live streams here, of like career challenges and just trying to get more people together here, so where we can just start actually getting some, getting some more stuff done besides some of the solo stuff. I still have solo stuff, but the solo stuff is solo stuff like the. Uh, uh, yeah, if you want, man, we're just doing this for a little bit. Oh, uh, yeah, more people. When I go over here, I'll register as a CEO. I'll invite you. I wasn't sure how much money I made on that, but it was probably like 50000 or something like that, too. They usually have it set up in this game to where uh, hosts make um, a lot more money than people that are helping. Like what is it for the clock and bell? Like okay, host gets five hundred thousand, but the but the person helping only gets fifty. Is that even worth it for somebody to help somebody with the clock and bell challenge if they're getting five hundred and you're only getting fifty? You could do a lot of other things in the game to get to make a lot more easier uh, money than that, helping people with clock and bell. All right, let's roll into the old hangar. Yeah, at this point, just for this one, I'm I'm just filling this one up. Like, I still have a lot of stuff to do here. This is why I'm going to try to focus on getting a lot more things done. I'm not, like, ambitiously going after things, like, day in and day out. You know, like, super grinding this. Like, what I said earlier in the stream, I was, like, playing some other games. All right, Rooster. Yeah, go, go get me one crate, man. Go get me one crate. <laughs> Thank you. All right, we got Rooster on the team. I'll be here. Got all Roosters. Look at how slow he is, too. Look how much money I just paid him. Look how slow he's walking. You think if I paid you $25,000, you'd be walking a little bit faster. Whatever, dude. I'll talk with him later. Don't worry about it. I'll have a talk with him later. Getting NPCs, you know? What do you do? What are you going to do about it? Land. It's going to always be land. Land is going to be easier. I'm sure of it. Just hope to God. Where does he want us to go? Wait, where? All right, this is why I'm thinking about changing. Uh, I'm gonna change almost. This is ridiculous, dude. How are we gonna go way out here, dude? I got. I should have just got another laser and flew out here. It's okay. We got the sparrow. Just hope we got. I don't hit anything on the way there. If I don't hit anything, we'll be okay. I'm gonna be able to get out there. The sparrow is actually. Uh oh. Uh oh. Or or the sparrow doesn't die. Because the Sparrow, whether people know this or not, is like literally one of the fastest helicopters in the game. It's faster than a car, I'm pretty sure. I just hope to God it doesn't die on the way there. It's probably going to die. We got to go all the way to Polito and this thing's already cut an engine. Let's just get as far as we can. That's the goal. Get as far as we can go and then we'll just get like a Mark II. Engine's cutting out. Uh oh, that's probably my fault right there. Whatever. We made it past the casino? Question mark. Hey, we made it to the casino. What the hit it, man? What are you doing? Need to go with Callahan. Brake pads. Yeah, 
Yeah, thanks for helping. Appreciate that. So we're racing out here. See so if we can get out here. Dude, I knew I should have just called Pegasus and got a freaking laser or something. That's what I should have done. This thing, dude, this thing, once again, only goes how fast? Can anybody see this pedometer? It's like 130 or something. I'm only going 130 right now. It's not, that's not very fast. Like, look at this. I'm heading out there. I'll be out there soon. Uh, next time, I'm not taking this thing, though. Not if we have to go to Polito. I'd rather just fly something faster. This thing's not that fast. So it's kind of disappointing. Yeah, they had that old Mark Mark II uh, oppressor speed glitch in the game for quite some time, though, didn't they? Be there in about two minutes. <laughs> if this is a decent vehicle from getting from like point A to point B, maybe like if you're in the city or something like that. But like, man, traveling out here, it's it's pretty slow. Definitely not one of the fastest vehicles in the game. All right, we're coming up on the spot over here. Yeah, should have should have went with Callahan. <laughs> Brake pads. I was talking about this the other day. If they came out, dude, if they came out with a with a a video game where you get to play as Chris Farley as the Great White Ninja, that that's what I I would buy that game for sure, dude. That'd be an awesome game. Make it like an open world RPG or something like that, but you got nothing but just Chris Farley antics the whole time. Yeah, see? Mark II Oppressor, slow as, slow as a snail. I'm not using that anymore, dude. We'll have it, but I'm telling you, I'm not using it. I'm going to get, like, the laser or something. The missiles are prepared. going on with that submarine over there it like glitched out huh how many missiles is this thing gonna take Oh, that I think they they glitched out and turned invisible on me. Uh oh. Yeah, they're invisible, dude. It, it was doing this last time we were. Do you see on my screen they're invisible? I have to like fish around for it. Oh, I got one. I got one. Yeah, they're invisible. Invisible crates. Once again, probably shouldn't be using this vehicle to get back to the city.
Can we upside down all the way to the... The way we can speed glitch this if we get it going right. <laughs> uh oh no don't slide down the mountain please okay we're good we're gonna try to do that fly upside down <laughs> all right now at this time the captain has issued the seatbelt sign Stewardess will be along shortly to pass out some alcohol. Did you guys see that freaking, that plane? I think it was in America here. There's a plane or something like that. Like the whole top of it, like 30,000 feet freaking rip, ripped off or something like that. It's crazy. A whole bunch of people died. Oh man, totally scary. They like showed pictures of the plane, like the whole roof of the plane was just ripped off. I think if you're a survivor, there's it's settlement time, right? Time for a settlement. It's either a class action lawsuit or a settlement. I'll take the settlement. From Boeing. Be like one of these multi-billion dollar companies. Write me a check for 50 mil. Would I still be a YouTuber? <laughs> sure. You see what I'm saying? It's freezing or something like that, dude. And then look, it wasn't even rendering up there. That's why I'm telling people, man. They don't believe me. I tell you, like, you're in the city. You think Polito Bay is there? Polito Bay is not there. Polito Bay has disappeared. Head back to the hangar. Am I going to be the... No, I'm not the first one because I took a crappy freaking vehicle here. Next time, I'm taking a good one. This thing's slow, slow as crap, dude. Come on now. It's a five. It's a five-minute drive. Nope, dude. I'm taking a jet next time. Swear to God, I don't even care. I'm getting the Raj out. The thing hovers. Hold on, fellas. We'll be there in a second. Wait for me. I just, I was messing around on Mount Chile. I back there, <laughs> flying upside down. I always shoot that. Yeah, we made it. I can't believe that though. It asked us to go all the way out to Polito Bay just for that crap, man. Uh, a lot of my vehicles are in storage here. Yeah. All right, hold on. I'm I'm calling them up now, dude. Yeah. Pegasus lifestyle manager. Great. The aircraft is waiting for you at our nearest airfield. We trust you'll be happy, sir. Call again. Goodbye. All right, there's mine right there. I just called it a laser. So I'm going to run like right over here. I'm gonna I'm gonna hop in I'm gonna hop in the Mark II oppressor. And I'm gonna fly to the laser, and then I'm gonna take the laser. I'm gonna fly somewhere else. So we're still waiting on some somebody. Oh, they had a Mark II also. Yep, you got a Mark II. Mark IIs are slow, I think. I'm gonna have a fight with my Mark II. Run it over.
That's why I can have the laser and the Mark II at the same time. And I think I could call a Sparrow out too. I don't know. I did a video, I think, on my last channel talking about how many vehicles can you have out at one time. You can have a, actually a lot of vehicles out at one time. You can have a lot, a lot of vehicles. All right. Gracias. Thank you. Yeah, I appreciate the help. They're just hanging out, chilling. It's Monday here in the United States and here on the here on the west side. Yeah, I was just doing random crates right now. Yeah, I don't know if it's going to count or not. Uh, Rick said it was going to count, but I don't know if it's going to. Sourcing! Let's do this. Alright, this time I'm getting a laser, though. I don't care. I already planned it. Hey, Ron, where do you want us to go? You want us to go all... Oh, it's not even that far away. I'm not even using laser for this one. It's in... It's in, uh... Where is it? It's in, like, South Shambles or something. It's right over here. It's not even that far away. I got the laser out just in case that if we had to do the stupid... Polito, Polito Bay. Hey, go all the way across the map. Not only that, go into the ocean. Have fun doing that. Does anybody at Rockstar even play this game? You're gonna find this place is locked up with some pretty heavy shutters. I... What do I actually get for completing all the career challenges anyways? Get a phone call from Rockstar. Yeah, this is the one where we gotta like find the thing to shoot. It should just be like right around here somewhere. It's just like a thing you have to like shoot it. Some, somewhere around here. Yeah, that's like the easiest one right there, dude. If there was like a way you could just keep getting that one right there. That's like literally one of like the easiest ones too. Because all you have to do, go to the location, freaking find the little box, shoot it. Same thing with like um, over there in the, the more richer neighborhood or whatever. And then like look how fast this makes this one. That's why I'm wondering, dude, if I worked on this for like a whole week, I wonder if I could get this one done. Like every day though, yeah. A lot of these challenges, they've been taking me like days. They're like, they're days. They're just like one day, it's like a couple, few days of like just like some hardcore grinding sometimes. And then other ones I just give up on. They just get boring and tedious. You're just like, yeah. Cause like, I don't even need the money. That's like the sad thing about it too. Like I don't even need the money. If I could just donate the money to somebody, that'd be awesome. I think too. After this one, I'm gonna end up relocating my uh, back to the military base. Yeah, I'm probably gonna go back out there. Is Rooster here yet? No, not done his job. I think it takes Rooster about 20 minutes or so, or maybe a little bit longer. Or it's like 48 minutes to do that. Sub G. Not much. Oh, it's about to be able to play some COD tonight. I think your headset's a little bit messed up, buddy. Oh. Sounded like a robot for a second. It's because I'm downloading something. What are you downloading? Uh, Modern Warfare 2. Modern Warfare 2. Yeah, those Call of Duty games, always a lot of... 
a lot of space for, for them. Oh yeah, that's uh, I just happened in here real quick to see what's well, going on with you. Well, if you think about like I think like right now my Call of Duty on on right now like dude it's taking up like 250 gigabytes or something like that. That's why people are, like people are like amazed too or something like because they're saying that GTA 6 is going to be like 500 gigabytes and I'm like that's not like too far fetched. You know what I'm saying? That's, there's game there's and... games out there that are more than 500 gigabytes. Oh yeah, that's the entire like first gen PS4 that came out. You know, right there. Uh, that's what they're that's what they're saying too and. Yeah. I'm just like I wouldn't I wouldn't be surprised. I hope it's like something like that. I hope the company spent like two billion dollars on it in freaking the to last make it ten years or something like that. Yeah, there's like yeah. a huge meme going on right now too. I don't know if you guys know this, but I guess there's a cure that came out for AIDS or HIV or something. Not like AIDS, but like basically HIV. So oh shit. I and there's like memes this. coming out and like there's just pages upon pages of people just memeing freaking GTA like like memeing the fact that a cure for HIV came out before GTA six. <laughs> They're like, come on, Rockstar. That is yeah, that is fucked. That's funny, but it's fucked. That's amazing. I I'm just saying it it, it is, but I'm just like what I what I've seen, there's just page, there's pages. Dude, my of, like people just has... memeing it. They're just memeing it. They're like, Where's GTA six? They're like, We get a cure for HIV, but we oh, don't get GTA six. Sam left? Like, because GTA 6 is going to be that big of a game, I think. I think everybody's probably going to, like, want to get that one. So, Call of Duty... Let me double-check this. Both CODs on my console are the biggest games. Cold War, whopping at a whopping 126.4 gigabytes. Oh and Modern Warfare 2 at 106.1 oh gigabytes. Plus, three more packs to download. Yeah, that's that's crazy. Yeah, Call of Duty always has like a lot of stuff. Good games. Just, I've always been a Call of Duty so fan for a really long time. I think I've kind of stuck. Now, a lot of the ones I, I that I've gotten, I've been disappointed, of course, with Call of Duty. And the thing with Call of Duty too is like it seems like these days they just try to push out a Call of Duty like every year now, like well, every it's year. It's like it's like for some of the Call of Duties, it seems like they're not taking their time, and you know, and they're almost just cut and copy some of them. And, and then they bring back old maps too, which like kind of pisses me off. Like, they don't they don't bring in new maps or something for that game. You're just like, dude. Yeah. So we're right now over here at the uh, just grinding some some hangers. Did you hear what happened? What? Uh, oh, dude, your your voice. I'm telling you, you're you're roboting. Okay. Am I not roboting anymore? Uh, it should be good. Okay. So, modded accounts today, aka duped accounts, have been banned. They have... I don't, don't know worry, how Rick. many accounts, but um, duped accounts have been banned. Oh, yeah, they're going uh, they're going ham on people, man. I've already, oh, I've already yeah. made a couple videos on this, for sure. I love it. You wait, what? I love it that they're being banned, finally. There's there's two sides of it. There's the sides of the people that have bought the modded accounts, and they seem to all be crying about it. Yep. And there's another side too of like basically your side. Well, there's actually a lot more sides than just two, but there's two major sides. There's the two major sides is the one that I just said. It's like the people who bought and modded accounts who actually paid money for them, and the people which, I, which I specifically for tell years. people not to do. And then it, it, and they get banned or something like that. With this Cluck and Bell raid that's out, I've made over like 40 million. I, I'm sitting on 26 million right now. I don't know. I have, I have nothing to buy. I'm just stacking my money up. Yeah, there's a you know, disorganized like uh, thing that I just posted too on the channel. Um, if you if you just, uh, you can do it solo. So if you just, uh, well, if you bookmark disorganized and you do, you actually do the setup disorganized and then right after that you go to the V and then you'll be able to do the heist. Yeah. You have, yeah, I actually, that's, I have that pulled up right now on, on Reddit. Yeah, I just posted that uh, method. There's a couple methods that are working right now. There's one with a friend that you can just get in, like, right into it back to back, but... Hold up, are you, on, you're on the Reddit page, right? I'm not on, on Reddit. But you, like, you check it. I know of it. I've known of it for a long time, yeah. Okay, yeah, dude, I... There's a I've, lot of, there's, um, there's, there's things, there's, there's pockets of information all over the place. There's a really nice place on Facebook, actually, to go to. I don't really check that I've one anymore. That. I've talked to Unknown Insider. Uh, that dude is, he is crazy when it comes to these There's, there's sub, there's subcultures in, uh, on, on, uh, X or, or Twitter, whatever. They're, they're all <laughs> over, dude. They're literally, it's all over. But bro, uh, unknown uh, unknown insider, which is like the one who's been finding a lot of the god modes. He, I think he was the one who originally found them. 
let me think. Because there's a really easy god mode out. I just did it the other day. Yeah, don't post that, man. Mode. I've lost too many channels. Yeah. Are you streaming right now? I am. Okay. Thank you for letting me know. Yeah, I'm on like my... This is like my sixth channel or something yeah, like that. Like, I I've lost like, so many fucking channels. No, because my girl asked me today. She's like, she's like, man, you play with a streamer, don't you? And it's like, he's not really a streamer. He does GTA things. Like, I don't know if he's he's branching. It's been a minute since I've watched his podcast. I stream sometimes. Not every time, but... Yeah, it's... I wouldn't, I wouldn't consider I myself a streamer, but we do live streams. Yeah. You, honestly, dude, I think you should start playing God. I really think you should start streaming God. Just a casual thing. Streaming what? What is it? COD. You guys play it well. Oh, you guys some COD. Yeah, we've, we've done that in the past for sure. Like, you guys haven't been playing a lot of COD. It's been a lot of snow on this that I've seen. Uh, no, kind of dipped out. Like, what sucks about that, we used to we used to play a lot of DMZ and stuff like that for, like, the PvP part of it, you know? Just kind of stretching it out and then, like, just kind of getting the... the because you can, like, stalk people in there. You can sit from far away with sniper rifles and all types of crazy stuff in that game. So, so you guys just... Because when I played with you guys in DMZ, it was just like, oh, let's, like, have fun. And now it was like, okay, we can actually PvP now. Because the when I first played with any of them, any of y'all, y'all were just, um... Y'all were getting, uh, kits. Y'all were just kidding up. Getting loot. Yeah, uh, we've been playing a lot of uh, DayZ lately. That's what we've been getting into. Yeah, pretty, I've been seeing that. It's pretty, pretty fun, pretty fun game right now. It's actually pretty popular right now in the world, I guess. The the immersiveness, uh, the sorry, I can't say that. I'm like shooting people right now. The immersiveness of it, like you know. Honestly, if you wanna get into, oh, you don't, you don't really play PC though. Never mind. Tarkov, man. Tarkov what is, is it the called? most immersive game. You yeah, there's a lot of games that people oh, recommend dude. for me to play out there. Tarkov, you like DayZ, Tarkov will be a whole fucking, whole ballpark of you to play. Yeah, I was wanting to play, uh, well, because I have DayZ on console right now, and I was wanting to play it on PC, because supposedly, like, what my friend was telling me, like, on PC, like, it's way better. You get to build a whole bunch more stuff. You get to freaking have way more vehicles. I guess there's there's more maps that you can that you can go into like you don't have to <clears throat> you don't have to like pay for or something. They I better like go robot. They have quick. a new map Tell I guess that they're making too in the game. I'm about to go robot real quick. Tell me if I end up fixing it. Did this do anything at all or my robot voice? Got the goods. Yeah, it's just my friend G Money popped into the the live stream. Known him for a while. He's on PlayStation playing COD. I got other friends right now. They're they're immersed in uh, DayZ and stuff like that. You know, not not all the friends are playing uh, the same game at the same time. That's fair. I used to play with you a lot when you got your four. That was some fun days. Man. A lot a lot of people are dipping out of GTA though. That's that's the thing. I've been trying to get out of it. Am I, a lot am of people I are just dipping way? out of it. Like they'll they'll do it for a bit, and I can and I can understand why. Like everybody's like kind of just tired of this. It's just it's just old. That the game's like going up on eleven years, and people people just want to like you know the the new one. I played so when yeah, the Vincent missions came out, I did not. I enjoyed them, but I just did the glitch, and there was no value to the missions to me. There was no value. Here, let me pull up your YouTube real quick. Yeah, I think that's one of the last things that I posted was the solo thing with the... That's like the latest stuff. Yeah, I'll pop on over somewhere and check out whatever, what's going on. Someone's found something. Yeah, I actually don't really look... Really I don't I don't look for too much stuff anymore these days. Not after... Not after all the crap, and I'm kind of careful with what I, what I pose, too. What is the you have to be, dude. After, after being around you for so long, you have to be, man. It's, it's crazy. Yeah, it is crazy though what's what Rockstar is doing. They're they're going they're going absolute ham with the the banning of like 
all different types of accounts too and this is and this is getting on um from from what reports are right now like all consoles i love so currently i'm like ps5 right like I, well pc they're not talking about pc because we already know that pc pc people get banned anyways because oh I'm yeah your chat right when now, you dude. when you get banned on pc too you have to you have to buy a new copy of gta it's only like five bucks though <laughs> It is cheap on there. Yeah, it's pretty cheap. You can get a new copy of that. Dude. But that's what happens when people like. So when you get banned on console, like your account, like basically, it's like the same thing there. Like your account would get banned, and you have to like literally buy you a whole the, brand new DTN like version of the game. Yeah. <clears throat> I'm reading your chat right now on AJ. Lol, modded accounts banned, but not God mode. That's crazy. <laughs> that is hilarious. Yeah, I know. I'm currently going through your chat reading it right now. Yeah, it's the it's the it's the logic, dude. It's like basically your Rockstar logic. Please give me the jet. You get shot at from somewhere. All right, it's down here. There it is, right there. How long have you been streaming for? Oh, you've been streaming for an hour? Uh, something like that. Yeah, hour forty six. Yeah, this is this is my Monday working on career challenges. Do you guys have career challenges on PS4? Nope. Yep, yeah, that's lame. Nope. You know what I have? Awards. That's it. <laughs> I have nothing else besides that. Yeah, I figure I too. It. They don't they don't they don't have them on PC. I know that either. Like they don't have they don't have it on PC. That's they don't crazy. have it on PC and they don't have it like I don't I don't understand like what they're going on here. It just seems like they're uh they're getting paid from these like sony let's just say they're getting the, which we we know that they are they have to be like from xbox and sony like they have to be getting paid like money just to make like let's just say if, if when gta 6 comes out is it going to be exclusive for just new gen consoles and it's not going to come out on pc or any or like i can imagine it's not going to come out on old gen because it's going to be you know it's going to be like one of those games you but, think they would have released everything on PC. But I just don't know if they're if it's gonna come out on PC or not. Like if it doesn't come out on PC and it's and it's specifically just for new gen, then you have to know for a fact that these guys are like. You well, know, you would have think they, they don't want people on PC, PC playing it. Because PCs like when it comes to graphics. That's what, yeah, that's where that's where all the modding yeah. comes in. Yeah. So but you like, think they, they would like. But, but they own 5M now. That's the thing, Din. 5M, I think, True. has been promoting the fact that they'll that they're going to be having like modded GTA 6 like servers. So then it has and, to be coming and it's out for. Be normal. Then it has to be out for PC coming out for PC at some point. I don't know. But the the better question is, do you think 5M servers are going to be like PlayStation compatible, like PS5 compatible? Or I, I don't know. PC. No. I think I think I, could... I think PC's PC. I I don't think that you're going to be able to do that with PlayStation. That's fair. I think it's kind of like one world over there. Dude, I want to get a PC for it's, that. It's where, right right now, if you look at the statistics, or you if you look at where most of everyone at, like a, a half of the community, like more than a half of the community is over there on PC playing RP right now. For all the people that play GTA, more than half of them right now are on PC playing RP servers. Because of the modded vehicles that they have, dude. You think yeah, we get good vehicles? vehicles? Uh-uh. They get good vehicles. They get crazy stuff over there, dude. That's why I always wanted to get into more PC stuff. But, like, man, I'm telling you, you can get griefed. And I've gotten griefed a bunch of times by people with mod menus. I just remember this one time when I was playing on PC. They're like, I had... Their chop was following me around. This is online, okay, online, and, and like chop was in my car and he was following me around. I thought it was cool at first. Wherever I went, chop was there. Like whatever I did, chop was there, and it's like, and it showed like a player's name, like on top of the head too. And I was like, okay, so this is like obviously someone who mod modded this, and, and Damn, now they're that's... and now they're a chop or something. And then they started killing me, like a whole bunch. And then like I couldn't do anything about it. Like I tried to get into a plane. Guess what? Chop was there, killing me in the plane. And I was just like, dude. So an estimated like players they have on 5M is 3.3 million, but guaranteed a day is 8,400k. Which and that, that's like statistical. That's not even like exact numbers, but that's crazy. 3.3 million and 5M has more players than any base version of GTA Online does. 
Yeah, and then I guess there's a lot of people on PlayStation though too. There's a lot of there's a lot of players on PlayStation Five. Oh yeah. I think there's a lot more players than there is on Xbox. That's why I think that's why if you hear um, that basically PlayStation won the console war, and that's why all these Xbox games are coming over to PlayStation now. Because, like, Xbox is not going to keep them exclusive, like, Xbox games anymore. That's why we've gotten, like, at one point, like, Halo and all this other stuff that's yep. come over to, that's come over here. And, and we're getting even more freaking games, dude. Sea of Thieves is coming out um, The only soon. thing I hope they give us is Starfield. Because I'm a big Bethesda and Oblivion player. I just finished the Outer Worlds recently, actually. 10 out of 10 would recommend the game to anyone. Great game if you're into um, RPGs. Great game. I was hoping God, that, that so we would have the technology money. to where I could cryogenically just freeze myself until GTA 6 gets here. Wake me up about a month before GTA 6 gets here. <laughs> Let me get all the good glitches out for GTA 5, and then, yeah, I'm going to play, boy. <laughs> let, me just, let me just do, like, what... Just get it. I mean, what kind of games are going to come out before GTA 6? Is there going to be anything like that? And besides, if anything good comes out, I can just play it then anyways. Do you like Fallout? Uh, I've played it. That's a... Uh... Okay. Are you into, like, I've, I've played a lot of games. games, yeah. It just probably would be old to me at this point. Uh, Starfield... Uh, Where do we have Starfield's to go? newer. Oh, uh, right there. There. Got this new Raja jet. You guys got I the Raja it. jet over there? Oh, yeah. Uh, we've had that for a while, dude. Yeah, I think okay. it's amazing. Yeah, I don't know if they dipped out on vehicles or anything like that. The only thing we don't have is uh, HSW and, like, probably one or two cars that you guys have. We don't have the weaponized Ignis. Well, people ask me, like, all the time, too. Do you think that GTA 5 is going to die when GTA 6 gets here? And that's a big fat no. 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 No, no way. I think there's still going to be like a lot of players our... playing GTA 5. Like, that, yeah, there's still actually a lot of players still playing um, Red Dead Redemption, too. Yeah. That's actually... It's crazy because that game is still constantly played. I have a group of friends who literally, like play that it's, like they it's have way better, better on pc do. though oh because yeah. they because oh, they yeah. never did the ps5 update and like people are talking about that like well if you go on to pc like that's it's way better like you get way better fps you get way better graphics like you actually if you had a really good graphics card you'd get to see like what the what the actual graphics I've, i don't have one necessarily but i've seen um youtube videos of like people with their what what that game is gonna look like, and you like, and then you like, you do comparisons of like, you know, maybe looking at the GTA 6 trailer, and you're just like, yeah, dude, GTA 6 is gonna look absolutely amazing. I think. I I just hope because I, I feel like Red Dead was just a, a test of their new software that they're exactly gonna be that's that for. that's their basically that's their new rage uh, their new rage engine right there yeah then that's what it's called that's their that's that their way their, of that like, was their okay. test for the thing I just hope yeah. to God it's not gonna be like we're climbing up a side of a hill or something we're sliding down like that crap or I don't know I uh... I can't say too. You know what I'm talking. You know what I'm talking how, about. Everybody that's yeah. played Red Dead Redemption Two knows knows exactly. Should know exactly what I'm talking thing about. Is like, you I start climbing up a little bit Red of a Dead hill, Dead and you're just like, eh, I'm up, sliding down now. I enjoy how Red Dead felt, even if it had like those small little things that just it made it. Oh my god! Unique. As soon as I got out, they didn't even care. Oh god! They just shredded you. I thought I was I okay. I thought wait, I thought I was. We're gonna make friends here with Anthony. <laughs> I have the stream pulled up so I can see what's going on as I play COD. I just totally got murdered. They didn't even care that I had the, the jet coming in or anything. So I was killing yeah, these dudes. I was gonna kill the dudes so they weren't gonna freaking like shoot at me when They're I was shooting at the trailer. They're not part of the gravesite gang, man. I gotta They're shoot not this. part of the gravesite gang. I gotta shoot this, shoot this trailer. <laughs> They're not fans of the gravesite gang. They don't like you. <laughs> oh, I need more mobility. Yeah, there's actually a brand new game that just came out. Um, I'm pretty sure it came out on consoles and everything like that. I'm waiting to, like, <clears throat> basically try to get it for free on PC, but it's called uh, Dragon Dogma. It's a brand new version of it. I think the last version uh, yeah, that came out was... Yeah, it's going to be capped at a 30 FPS on console on PS5. Is it I really? That's why I'm getting it on it. PC, yeah. man. It's better to get on PC. I actually just seen someone talking about that today. Yeah, that's that's lame, too, that it's capped out at 30 FPS. Like, I, yeah. I can't stand 30 FPS anymore. Like, I'm, I'm addicted to, like, the six, 60 or right? better, dude. Like, I need 60 or better. New gin in my life. This is what it does to people, man. 
they're like, I can't do that, man. That's fucking nice. I don't know. No, I, I can't. I, I, I can't go back, it. dude. It's it's weird. I've uh, my dad just got a five recently, and it, it's definitely different to watch people play on it. But it uh, well, there's some aspects about about the the five that I don't like that compared to like the four and stuff like that. Well, you can't double tap anymore. Nope. Can't do that. that controller, like the controllers that. are not like skinny and freaking whatever. Dude, They're like yeah. more heavy. They don't last I longer either. Like they don't. How many like, have you went through already? If I if I may ask. Uh, controllers. Yeah. Not none, just one. Oh, okay, yeah. I was about to say like I'm already about to go through. I want to say like my third PlayStation controller, but I'm not easy on these controllers, man. I I've been playing games for a long time. There's I'm not easy on these controllers. All right, I got it. <clears throat> You yeah, the Raj is a really good jet. I hope, hope, hope they have something like this in GTA 6. I don't know. I really like, enjoy the Pyro. Did, the did we get to look at a military base in the trailer? There was no, no. But Jason's, Jason's trailer is going to be the next trailer. That's why they did Lucia's. The next trailer that we're going to get to see is that's why everybody's like, oh, Lucia is going to be like the best character. Be like, yeah, but we didn't even get to see like what Jason's about. He only said one thing in there. Like the whole trailer, he said like one thing. Lucia like looked at him and said like, oh, something you know to the end or something like that he's like yep <laughs> that's like the only thing he said You're like we don't, i don't even think anybody's figured out who the voice actors are yet like nobody's figured out who the voice I, actors I are i don't think do you know um who dark viper he used he has a he has an ongoing uh, uh, twitter feed of like uh i can back this information i am a uh gta 5 or gta 6 voice actor like, it's, it's a meme, but it's hilarious, dude. Whoa. Ooh. This thing's crispy. Another crate. You're gonna no. make me. You're gonna Back make to me, me and easy. Rooster. Looks like Rick, Rick is left, and we got another person leave. That's okay, though. We got 15 people watching right now. That's why. That's why we called it career career challenges. Well, we get a lot more when it's coming to uh, trading modded cars. I don't know if you do that much, but I I don't try. Or, I don't or, know. Or, or try to participate right in those. They they pop off a lot potentially on on all consoles now. I have Rock, to ask. Rockstar what, finally um, like did that. You can actually buy vehicles over at the LS car meet now on PS4, oh, okay. Xbox One. Yeah. I thought when you said trading cars, you meant uh, gift cards to friends. But no, not, not necessarily. No. I haven't even done one of those in a minute. Yeah, I've not seen one of those pop up in a while. I've been looking for a good one. I, I know there's, there's a glitch out method right now for like the but terabyte, just, but there I don't think that there's a, a working method. The they pub, just keep patching like, them, keep patching them. I get tired yeah. of keeping up on it at one point. I've been doing glitches for so long too, and it's just like I'm just kind of done with the GTA 5 glitches. I'm, I'm not done with them, but like you know, like it just it's an annoying. There's, there's not, not there's not like a glitch in this game. It's just GTA 5 is always going to be GTA 5 to me, and like I want GTA 6 because finding like glitches in GTA 6 is going to be like super exciting you know like do you think the online mode is going to be like it is launch on glitch give, like... give us give us a launch glitch that sends us like all the way into space or something exactly <laughs> i agree with that's that. what i want i want something like that you know I want something like something amazing So listen, I just heard about a group of wannabe treasure hunters searching for some sunken cargo. Oh, now, ser searching for some sunken cargo. All right, another one of these missions. Where is it at, anyways? Is it going to be way out in... Nope, it's going to be out here. Alamo C. That's all right, though. We got the Raja, so we should be able to get there decently fast. Yeah, I think they got a Dune um, video game. I want to check out the gameplay a bit. It's supposed to, it's coming out later this year in 2024, but it's based off of the movie. And it, it's, oh, I don't Dune? know. It's supposed to be like a super huge PV, PVE, PVP type deal, open world, and like you choose factions, and it's it's like that. So it'd be like a world that you live in, like. But there's 
it's PvP and it's PvE. So the, you'll be you'll be killing real players and non-real players and stuff like that. So at any point, you could just run across a real player. I think I know what you're talking about. I, I've seen uh, there's there's a trailer on it or something. It just looked it looked kind of cool, but but here's the thing though: looks are looks can be deceiving from like mechanics of a video That's true. game. Like, what are the mechanics this is like? True. My PlayStation. You get vehicles and all types of stuff in that. In that. <laughs> Do you have someone else in your lobby? Yeah, farm rate is still working. Uh, how much do I get? It depends on on what I'm doing. Right now, I'm not going to be getting very much. I'm just trying to grind crates, and I don't care. And I don't care of like what type of crates they are. Now, if I was going after a certain amount of like a certain type of crates, I could be getting in like a 70% bonus. So on the 1.5 million dollars, that's what you get for for 50 crates. But if you did like all chemicals or you did all narcotics, you're going to be getting a 70% bonus on that. And if you did it in a public session, you're going to be, be getting a 50% bonus on top. Dude, every single time I get out of my skin jet, I just get killed. Why do they wait? This is emotionally I disturbing. I think, I think I'd be afraid of a, a 50 cal jet. Putting explosive rounds. They're like, just me. let that land and let the guy get out, and then we'll shoot him. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> dude, I would be afraid. Like, like what the I don't heck, know what you're man. saying. Okay, COD feels a lot better on this other controller. Yeah, COD's fun. Can be. I, I, my controller has really bad stick drift, and I've not played the game in over like, a year, so I have to. Readjust. Gotta get your thumbs warmed up. You guys know about that. If you play on console, you play on freaking controller. You gotta get your thumbs warmed up. Well, that and I just have really bad stick drift from um like. Oh, they got a sniper. I you don't do. have a sniper. Clean out, clean okay. your controller with something. Uh, I'll take it apart soon. I'll take it apart soon. Yeah, at some point, I think you, if you know what you're doing, you can take them apart and then you can clean the. Uh, you can just take the front the front cover thing off or something to where you can get to the where the, the joysticks things are and there'll be probably yep. some gunk build up in there from just natural whatever. Well, that and I'll probably have to happens. replace my rubber. Shut up. Yeah, we had two people in here. They left. I don't know what's going on. Rick said that he had something important happen. Not sure what that was. Unless he, or unless he just came to the realization that this game is old and boring. Do you blame him on that though? I don't blame anybody on it. I'm I'm sticking in here until the wheels fall off, okay? I'm 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 in here until until GTA six. Like I'm they, doing that. They I'm riding fell this off one. A long time ago. Like they're they have to do one at least one last good DLC and there's only at least two more left. There's only about two more left. That's it. Like there's gotta be. Two more, that's it. Alright, I'm gonna take my jet and I'm gonna fly it over there to the one location. It's all the way over here. Yeah, that sucks. That um, I don't even know if you can put jets inside the back of MOCs anymore. But I used to put the I used to have a jet inside the back of Buzzard. my MOC, and then I'd just be like, and then I just call the uh, call the MOC or your interaction menu. You go to the you go to the MOC or whatever, and then uh, request personal vehicle, and then it's just like bam, you just got like a, a pyro. <laughs> There was another glitch too that you used to be able to do. I can't remember. It was something with your phone, and you'd be able to call up, um, call a jet like right by you, like anywhere. I know what you're talking about. I actually, I've there's seen a, a lot there's of a bunch people, of methods um, for it, like on how to yeah. do it at one point. It I know was, someone it was, who it was does pretty that. Fun. Yeah, there's a lot, there's been a lot of fun glitches. At one point, we like to I like to do those uh, videos of looking back at glitches and things like that. There's a glitch here, just talk about things. Like you guys, was anybody around for this or remember that? You know. I'm still, I'm still gonna probably it? say today the most funnest time that I've ever had in GTA was probably the Green and Purple Alien Wars. That was like, fun. Like I, I was there. That was two weeks of just like it just because everybody was on point. Nobody was like cheating. Nobody was using guns. Nobody. Everybody was just using melees and Baseball and they were bats. and everybody was teaming up and and becoming friends or enemies and it was just it was it was an awesome thing I think. All right, so now I'm not gonna be able to get over there. That's great. 
Because I need a game... boat. Well, at the, at the same time, that was when uh, KD was a thing, wasn't it? I'm pretty sure it was. Yeah, that was. So, that, like, during that, it was it was very fun because everyone was teaming up having fun, like you said. But, like, also, like, you would get a lobby of people, like, doing that. And then you'd have that one KD keeper in the lobby who just hated the world and didn't want to, like, actually have fun with yeah, it. Yeah, there's, there's big big things that I that I interacted in and stuff like that. Um, I, I had all that stuff, like, on an old channel. It's sad it's gone, but... Of just like meeting up, like like basically the purple the purple team meeting up with at, at like the military base or something like that. Because if you get killed at the military base, it'll spawn you like outside. So I, I'm pretty sure that's what it'll do. I still remember the Beavis and Butthead skit. Yeah, that one was pretty fun. Yeah, we used to do that, a lot like, of funny stuff over here. We'll probably be doing stuff some more funny do, yeah. stuff at some point. Yeah, losing those channels sure did suck. It did. I, I remember. Lost, I lost like, thousands of videos. Still tons to this of day, time I remember and, the, and building the up stream. things. I'm still to this day. I remember the stream of you uh, transferring from Xbox to Ford. And you were like, well, like, uh, let me set up my Elgato. And I was like, no, 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 man. Just click the stream button. <laughs> Next thing you know is you're on PlayStation full time now. Like, yeah, you just can't do none of that on Xbox, man. Dude, it's amazing on here. Like, don't get me wrong. The, dude, the dude I don't even think now. that they have, like, a clipping thing over there, honestly. Dude, I don't even know. Like, on Xbox, amazing. not on Xbox One. Now, I don't know anything about the Xbox Series. I, I was going to ask my friend that because he says he has one. Like, he bought one, but, like, he never plays it or something like that. And, I was and like, then huh. you, uh, yeah, I remember because you were like, oh, like, I'm going to edit this video. And I'm like, oh, just download uh, Share Factory. And next thing you know, it's like you're ed you were editing videos through Share Factory. It was amazing. That swap over was. Yeah, we use uh, we use Premiere now. Yeah, that's fair. That's fair. Get Premiere, get Premiere for free, and do that. What do you use it on? Like, what a just a PC, it... man. Just I'm Premier, on a Chromebook right now, man. Just a free man. Premiere on a PC. At some point here, I'm gonna have to get a probably a new download or something, a new 2024 version or something. I think I still have the. Like a 2023, but hey, if it gets the job done, gets the job done. Hey, I've been, I've been, I'm on a Chromebook right now, and I'm about to start trying to do stuff with it. But like, I didn't know a good recording software at all or anything like that. Uh, best recording, recording software, software I would say is probably like Adobe. Anything, Adobe, anything yeah. Adobe is like probably or, one uh, of the one of the best <laughs> stuff. Like anything, like I use Adobe for everything, dude. Or editing. I've never edited yeah. anything, and plus do share factory. Like yeah, like, uh, Adobe things. Edition for like recording vocals, and then like for editing stuff up and editing videos, like really good. You use like Adobe Premiere, and then anything else would be like Adobe, uh, Adobe Photoshop. <laughs> like enough. those those three programs Probably right there is like all that you really need: Adobe Photoshop, Adobe Adobe Edition, and then Adobe um, Premiere. And you can probably plan, you can probably pirate all that stuff for free too. Well, like I'm on a like I said I'm on a Chromebook, so like I'm planning because I'm about to start working a part time job, and I was like you know I might as well go like getting into YouTube and like see see if I can go anywhere with that, you know, take the take the risk, and that's kind of my plan with it. So I just it, editing software is all this stuff is really needed because I just need to know all of it. I I've never even like the only thing I've ever touched was like Share Factory, and, you know, save a clip on PlayStation. 15 minutes. Well, or if you plan on being a streamer or something like that, uh, right now supposedly Kick is uh, like one of the best ones Kick to stream is on. Great. Like a lot of people are switching over Kick. I've had a lot of people ask me if I was like going to start doing stuff on Kick, and I was like, I'm not really, I'm not really streaming like every day. And if I am going to stream, I might as well just stream on YouTube because like I'm mainly on YouTube. So, Dan, I, I'm, I would, I would probably go to Kick because like yeah, that's YouTube what that's has... what my brother always told me too. He's like, man, I wouldn't be doing YouTube. He's like, but he's like, I, if I were you, I'd be streaming like on Twitch. He's like, you're gonna be a lot better. Twitch. But I never, I never, YouTube. I never really did that too much. You know, Twitch and I YouTube am on Twitch. Like, I could live stream on I live stream on Twitch any time that I want. I just I just don't do it necessarily every single day. It's not like an every single day thing that I'm doing. Maybe at some point I'll do that. I'll I'll, I'll step things up. But yeah, you know, it's so like you'll, when GTA 6 gets things, here. Yeah, I can imagine I'm I'm probably gonna be live streaming that game like every day. Like honestly, if I were you too, like I would do like a separate channel dedicated to like playthroughs, like gravesite. Yeah, plays, people people know? do that too. People have like um, yeah. people do like um. Uh, short channels you know what i'm saying Re gravesite reacts gravesite plays gravesite shorts yeah, yeah. you can do stuff like that but you know then something that something that pewdiepie always said a long time ago too you like i know it'd probably be like people like well that'd be cringe to listen to him well i'm just saying you know he he only had like 100 plus million subscribers so you think that anything he that had he would, it down he would say he had uh you know he had something or he had the i don't know 
he was in favor of the algorithm that's for sure i that and i also believe that like it was it, it's cute, cor it's corruptness that goes on there youtube yeah. for sure like it's total it's total I, corruptness I look at it how it's like it's that like, he was like a Mr. Very Beast funny videos. Movie. Like you, you're telling me that freaking YouTube doesn't push like Mr. Beast videos because you know the other oh, no, views they that they get and everything else. And like they do because they're because they're making money off of Mr. Beast. And I've seen dude, dude I've seen ads on I've seen ads on channels that don't even have like a thousand subscribers, and I'm just like, why why would they put it? Oh, and then you then you dig a little bit deeper on it, and you're like, so it's so YouTube is putting ads on someone's channel that doesn't even qualify to have ads on it just so YouTube can have more analytics on their part of saying look we're running more right. ads we need we need more we need more revenue so who and who's getting revenue out of that like that's purely that's it, it's purely whatever that's and, all I think, I, and I think it's, it's, it's like a 70 30 split too I'm not, I don't know I don't know what it is that's why I was that's why people would say like go to kick because kick for streaming is like I think kick is like 90 75 it, yeah it's like, it's like yeah it's like 95 it's like 95 yeah. to 5 or something like that you get to keep and like, like 95 that's where I want to go if I would stream because like it, yeah, it, in all honesty like you know, I was no thinking about trying it out at least twitch is like seeing dude, what's going on over there seeing if it would twitch, be better you than YouTube to do you know ads to be able to make money well, and the like, only thing about YouTube to too is like ads. I can't I can't cuss over here. Like that's that's what yeah. that's what I don't like about YouTube is all the all the policies and all the you you know you can get in trouble for for. I want to be able to make and the even jokes if you're I joking, make normally. You know, even if you're joking about certain subjects, like they don't take it as a joke. You know, okay. you can't say like certain jokes. That's also why, like, if I'd ever get into streaming, I'd want to do it on Kick, cause Kick, I can. Well, that's why I like about Twitch, because Twitch, I can cuss as much as I want, and cuss as much exactly. as I want, on, and no one cares. No one cares. I could say the f word as many times as I want on on there. That's why, if you've caught on, every time I come in here, I ask for streaming, because. Yeah, YouTube, pirates, I gotta, I gotta be like no pirates, cuss words. Dude. I can put in like one cuss word, like, but that's about it. Yeah, and that's 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 ridiculous. Pardon my French. But that is ridiculous. Like, that is horrible. They're gonna kill me. Oh, I got him. Well, I put the channel set to freaking, like, an adult channel, not meant for kids. Yeah. Like, you know, that that means, like, potentially there's gonna be some cuss words. They they don't. And they're they just like, you. So now I'm, now I'm just chill. Wait, where's the truck? Are you down here? Well, because this one time I got like a freaking, uh, I got actually in trouble for like um, hate speech. But basically, what it was is just the excessive word of the f word in one of my streams or something. Because I was all f this and f that, or I was, or maybe it was in a video or something like that. I can't but quite still, remember. Even, but even by I just remember word, like, and I was stupid. just like, and then that's I got in just, trouble for it because they were saying it was like hate speech or something like that. And they're just like, yeah, this is classified as hate speech. And I was like, wait, hate hate speech. What, con what know, country is YouTube living in? Because I'm living in a country where we got freedom of speech. Dude, no, yeah, we, I was... <laughs> that's like an amendment. But what is that, a, you know, getting getting oppressed no, and suppressed? These are the times we're living in. I was about to be like, ah, oh, man, like, I know hate speech. Right? Like, I know what hate speech is, man. Like, I live, <laughs> I live in I Kansas. Even, I, I know what hate speech is. <laughs> I live in Kansas, man. Hate speech. Bad. <laughs> What's up, Mr... Mr. Steely? Yeah, we're just uh, doing Career it. Challenge Monday because it's Monday. Where I live right now, it's pretty crappy outside, so... Just basically locked in my, my dungeon of, of gaming world, which is where I like to be. This chat's always going on. You got to question that, too. If you play a lot of games, where do you live more? Do you, do you live more in the real life, or do you live more in video games? I don't know. I don't know, I'm man. Got a lot you ever, of friends. You got know, a lot. Got a lot more friends over here than in real life. Facts. Do you uh, do you know the saying? Um, and again, pardon my French. Do you know the saying? Uh, high on life. Poulet du la. Wait, what? Do you know the saying? High on life. Uh, high on life. Yeah, sure. Yeah, and that's how that's 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 how my life is going. On. I don't. I, I enjoy sitting around playing games all the time, but I don't. Well, there's definitely uh, a big aspect. You can't just sit around and play games all the time, I don't think. But if yeah, you have the choice, no. but if you had the choice to move into video yeah. games like oh, a Wreck-It exactly. Ralph, I'm telling you, I'm there. I'm skipping out. I'm gonna say goodbye to everyone, and that's it. I'm like, hey, you want to meet me? You know, 
Pick pick a game and I'll meet you there. Just make sure it's online. You probably don't want to PvP me PvP me because at that time, since I'm living in a video game, I'm gonna get real good. <laughs> Well, they were talking about how you could do that stuff now these days, dude. I don't know if you guys know about this technology, but, like, there's a technology out there that can, like, it's, like, it can, like, almost implement, like, you know, the essence of you or something like that and save you into, into like, a program That'd or something. That'd be sick. Like, I don't know. I don't think, they like, you actually get to exist. It'll be, like, a, like a piece of you, but, like, I don't know. It's like an AI. Dude, Did you, you guys hear what those, thing, yeah, those, right? those Google glasses? You can have NPCs, like, in your house. Oh, God. I was like, That's what kind of NPCs? Hey, wait. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? What kind of NPCs? Can we modify those NPCs? Hey, yo, wait a minute. Double, back, double, back triple, up. triple, double Zs. Can't fit through the door. <laughs> back that saying up real quick. <laughs> That's crazy. I don't know. I, I've seen some crazy things with those new Google Hold glasses, though. Quick. Technology is getting crazy. Sourcing! More. Wait, should we see if Rooster's here? I don't think Rooster is here. These are probably the best ones to go after. I can go after something else. We'll go after something else that's not going to be any different, though. Look at this. We'll go after this one here. Okay. I had to see how like well you can hear my audio <laughs> through the stream. Alright, where is it? So if, I do, if oh. I do say anything crazy. Oh, is it because those are the harder ones? I wonder if it does that, too, dude. If I could just fill this up with crap, I'm doing that. A lot faster. I was about to say, honestly, selling that full is not a lot of money. Most it's, of the time. it's only 1.5. Oh. That's, that's, and it's not that much, considering still... the fact that you have to earn you have to earn 50 million, and I'm only at like 14 right now. I... 50 million for what? Yep. It's a long grind. Like grinds like this, dude. This is this would take. I don't know how. Oh, if you, you have you, to if earn I just did this day in and day out, and I don't have any help, this would take a long time. This would probably take a couple weeks working on this every day. Well, I was also about to say, man, uh, if you sell in public lobbies, does it count for the bonus per person? Yeah, I don't know, dude. We, uh, I was, I, I had my friend in here, Rick, or something like that, and he was trying to sell, uh, do a sell or something like that, and it didn't, it didn't count. That's crazy. It should have potentially. It was yeah, supposed you'd to. Yeah, think it would have. He said it. He said it. It was supposed to or something like that. Like I don't know where you got that information, but. Take care of this on the boat here. Uh oh. Don't worry. Let me get myself out of here. It's a smoking. Not getting shot this time, am I? Oh, I'm on fire! All right, we're heading out to the boat. The boot. That's sniper. That's how you get onto a boat right there. Grandpa dinghy up there. Looks like a charm. All right, get that. This is dumb. Every single time you have to do this, dude. Like, the... go to the location, swim in the ocean, get the submarine. All 
All right, we're going down into the ocean. Ooh, we gotta go way down here, huh? Wait, where is it? Dude, it's like super far. I can't even see down here. Did I get it? It's right there. All right, we gotta take this to the terminal. It looks like. I might just drive this, this back. Automatic vehicle I have. Oh, that's not an automatic vehicle. Yeah, for 2024, they still have to, uh, a lot of games to announce for this year too. So, and it's like there's well, still honestly, like what yeah. is it? April, May, June, July, August, September, October, November, and then December, and then. Finally, 2025 is going to be here. That's a long time, man. That's many, many months. Oh, yeah. We're going to... I hope by then we have And then... Years. Dude, I hear people on Twitter, and they're like, Oh, I can't wait for GTA GTA 6 to drop on January 1st. And I'm like, are you... What kind of crack are you smoking? Probably the best, because there's no way that game's coming out on January 1st. Oh, no. <laughs> like, knowing Rockstar, dude, they'll push it, they'll push it back until, December. like... December. December of right before 2026, yeah. probably. Yeah. That they will do that too. They will. <laughs> it's no hate against Rockstar, but it's it's the god honest truth, man. They they just don't care. Uh, if you get hit with a daily sell limit, you're gonna have to wait like 30 hours or something like that, and potentially, yeah. But by the way, they've they've adjusted the daily sell limit in GTA now to where you cannot sell as many cars as you used to, and they also did another implication of. You cannot sell duplicated cars anymore, basically. They're they're know, I, they're I shutting it down. They're shutting it down big time. They're they're closing so much stuff up. They're like they're cleaning it up, dude. I'm telling you, they probably got in trouble from their investors. I could I could imagine that being a big problem when that comes when that comes to like a a, a meeting, you know. You think you think about this? If you're a stockholder with Rockstar and you had like stock in the game, do you think your stock is going up as long as people keep, you know, duplicating accounts and doing money glitches, and the company doesn't sell shark cards? You know, hey, like w your profit that, is how good the company w they does. Got banned, like your your w profit they got is how good the company does. If the company's not doing good, then your stock is going to be going down. That's how that works. So of course, of course, they're probably cleaning. They're cleaning it up before GTA 6. Like, yeah, 10 years too late, probably. Oh wait. Like that's why nobody understands. That's why it's called Rockstar Logic because we'll never be able to understand why they implement these things in the game with the time that they do. It's so accurate though. <laughs> you just don't. You just don't even know. You're like, why? Why? What's the point? They don't like. They don't even give you. They don't even give you a reason too. They're just like, whatever. They don't like what people can do to their game either, though. Like how easily it's... Broken. I'm sure it pisses them off. I'm oh, sure, yeah. I'm sure. It's got to make them mad. That's why That's why I talk about the whole 5M thing. Like, do do people really think it's just a cut and, uh, cut and dry freaking situation there? Because I don't. I honestly think that situation was either you're rolling with us or we're rolling right over you. <laughs> I can believe that. I, I, I seriously can. think to, to no take too interactive... Dude, Take Two Interactive just got done suing somebody for like their logo looking like like theirs or something like that, and I'm just like, what? It doesn't look anything like theirs. Like, looks nothing like theirs, or something like that, dude. They they go after people all the time. They're they're not. If cool. you have something and they want it, it's theirs. Yeah, you're not gonna be able to do anything about it. Yeah. Not against the triple A multi billion dollar company that has a team of lawyers. That's why you guys hear about those people that are coming out and they're like, oh, 
Rockstar needs to pay me money because they stole my like my likeliness. Like there's there's more than one of them that came out. There's like several of them I now. Know. There's like seven of them now. I think. But the came Joker's out. like the everybody most wants a, Everybody just wants money. They just want money. I want to see the Joker's want money. Most, most known one by Like by most far. of you wouldn't even do anything good if they gave you money. Like you're gonna you're gonna you're gonna go help out some charities or something. You're gonna go help some blind people or or you know. Go help some kids that have leprosy or some kids in the in the, the hospital that are dying from cancer right now? Probably not. Those are some things that They're I would think about doing run. though. We're gonna take a run. Like let's let's take all these kids to Disneyland before they before they die. I'll pay for it. Money's fake anyways. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just not telling wrong. you. Not wrong. It's 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 that real, but it's, but it is also fake. I'm telling you, this whole system's messed up, man. The whole system needs to be on trial. You can't handle the truth. I know things, cause I've been living in the system long enough to know the system. Anybody that that has a, a a decent head on their shoulders should know. Look at that, we made it all the way back. Drove back, dude. Wait, did you die during any no, of it? Not. What's up, Pablo? W. Pablo Escobar. He's getting shot at the whole time, too, by those bulls. Yeah, actually, I have. I was giving Rooster enough time so he could come back. Rooster, are you back now, buddy? Rooster's not, I Rooster's have not even back. My yacht's named after Pablo Escobar. <laughs> it's Pablo Escobar's yacht. That's what it's named. That's amazing. Yeah, I've noticed that, too, at some point. I was wanting to make a video. Like, I was just going to go into a public session and go check out people the names of people's yachts. Oh, yeah. They get funny, dude. They get yeah, there's really some funny. pretty funny ones on there. Uh, another thing too is people's uh, CEO CEO names too. People have like really funny CEO. Names. I I had seen the most. I, I think you can today. stretch a little bit more on the yacht name. I'm not quite sure if it's not if it's. I'm pretty sure you can do a little um, bit more on the yacht name. My friends is uh, my friends is El Chapo's yacht, and then mine's El Rubio's yacht. Right on. My mine just says graveside on like YouTube. <laughs> my yacht is promoting my YouTube, YouTube channel. Yeah. Go check, go check it out. There's got to be at least a video over there that's going to help you with something. I don't focus on one thing. I do everything. You know, it's crazy because um, I've am i been playing with a lot of people recently. Dude, no one... I, I've told people, like, oh, you know, go watch Graves' videos. Like, he, he'll teach you some, some stuff. No one, no one knows who you are. It's sad. It's really sad. I have, like, two people that, like, know, know who you are. Yeah, well, we used to be a lot bigger... But, yeah, you know, we keep well, getting, that's, that's like, we keep I've getting shut down. I see how it works, though, man. I'm telling you, nobody nobody cares, dude. I, you lose you lose a hundred thousand subscribers. Where is everyone? They just they just move on to something else because you'll find out originally that the only reason that they're subscribed to your channel is because of like because you made a glitch or something. You posted a glitch. There's a big difference between having like fans. Like the people right now that are watching, those are like fans. I would consider myself one. Those are like those I, are like I fans. Would consider myself. Those are like fans, friends, whatever. People that people that love GTA, like I love GTA. GTA was a game changer for me, man. I'm telling you. This this game, like I was stuck in some dark places at the time. GTA five came out and it freaking it lifted me up from the darkness of all the other crappy video games I was playing. Besides Destiny at the time. I was playing Destiny. I, I had a really, really fun summer. Dude, Destiny, Destiny. was a very Destiny one, game. like year one, that was like some of the funnest stuff right there. And all these raids I know coming out. Who, like, people actually were on their two. microphones and talking to each other, me making friends. It was just like now a lot of people are just knew, toxic. I was about to say I know a dude who plays um uh, Destiny two. Like that is his only game that he plays. Like yeah, literally, yeah, I can't he plays do it just religiously. Game, man. He plays it religiously. It's bad. I can't do that. I can't do that. Not until GTA Six gets here. <laughs> like right now, there's just not a, think... there's not a game good enough out that I, I can play it religiously. But... Yeah, I used to have a friend too. Oh. He used to play a whole bunch of a whole bunch of uh, Destiny and stuff like that. I think they're playing Rust right now, so they're really into Rust on PC. 
That's like one of the main games that they play. Rust is a very toxic base game, though, man. Oh yeah, oh yeah, it's super, it's you super toxic, to, dude. That's what, I, dude. That's what I'm finding out about DayZ. Like DayZ is like super toxic, I guess. Like, I, and I didn't realize it was like that toxic. Not like every probably lobby. So what, what we're doing, right? I was like asking my friend Turf to like hopefully find a session or a lobby that we can go into to where like they have rules. You know what I'm saying? Like, like only on the weekends there's base raiding or something like that to where. I actually have a I have a friend who plays and like uh, just certain because like like what I was saying, dude. We got we didn't we didn't just get raided like we we had a really cool base and we didn't just get raided like we got absolutely griefed beyond belief to where it's like if I had somebody on my on my like I would probably just ban them or something like that because that's like it's uncalled for the type of the type of griefing they basically took our tents and they replaced them to where we can't even use them anymore. You can't like nobody can use them. You know, they, they took barrels of ours and they just shot them to where you can't even move them. They took cars and they parked them right in front of our gates, like just and they just blew them up and stuff. And like basically That's the whole thing about crazy. taking the tents and like you can't even you, you couldn't even make it to where someone could just come back here and rebuild their base. Could you No, you had to go and you had to like do all this extra shit. Like that's what that's what pisses me off about it too. Like and that's that in my mind, dude. That's what like a lot of people are at these days. Sometimes like the toxicity. I'm sorry, but like for you to go like the extra mile or something like that to to do that to someone is like that's a flaw in your character in real life. Like there there's no I, I don't know. I can't imagine myself necessarily doing that. Like if I raided your base, I raided your base. I've raided tons it's of bases no so far in DayZ. Not one time did we ever grief their base. Like. To the extent that we got griefed, it was just unnecessary. So, would like, you grief the griefers? I would grief a griefer. Hell yeah, I would. Okay, they would yeah. deserve. So but I, but I would just say this is like probably just not. Just don't go back into that server necessarily. Go find that's a better. Fair. Go find a better server where you know that there's people that aren't operating. Because it was a big team that did it. It was a big team of people, and we think we know who did it too. Because they're dude. Because they freaking went onto the Discord and they're all talking crap or something like that, dude. They were like talking crap to us because one of my friend Terp was saying like on the Discord like how come you like you rate you didn't just raid us you went in and you like you 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 replay you glitched out every one of our tents. You know what I'm saying? Like, you couldn't take it, so you just decided to glitch it out. So, like, nobody could take it ever. So you just basically glitched out, like, this whole area. And, like, I wouldn't, I wouldn't think if I was an admin or the owner of the server that, like, I would want people running around, like, making all these glitched out areas that are potentially going to make the server or, or the, you know, the session and sh more buggy. Right? Like, why would you want that? No. I mean, I, I know That's it probably busy. sounds like I'm just I'm just like whining here because I got because no, we got no. raided and stuff. But I'm just telling like, like, dude, they could have raided us and took all of our stuff. I would have been fine with that because like that's what my friend said. Uh, yeah. No, they actually griefed us to the point like nobody can take the tents now. They parked two cars like blowing up in front of the in front of the gates. So, like nobody can get in there, and like it, it's just it's pathetic, dude. Like why not why not make it dude, more that's... competitive? Like why not just grief us, take the crap, and then let us find you at some point, and then we're just gonna come back and like raid you instead of don't taking the extra mile. And you know it's like playing dmz so this is like what someone would do sometimes in dmz so like call of duty is what i'm talking about okay you get killed right i know what you're talking about and then someone comes and resurrects you and then guess what someone did they actually took the time to take every single thing that you have out of your backpack even your and spotter scope everything everything like everything it's all gone and they just and, and they it. you take it out so what happens when they take it out of your bag it, de it it'll despawn all your guns will despawn your your backpack stuff will despawn everything you're just like, dude, why why go the extra mile to do that? Why not just put me, you know, who cares? Like, you took extra time to come over to my dead body and just take everything out, which took, you, you know, one thing at a time. Like, and then just place it on the ground. You're like, fuck. I don't do that to people, dude. I don't grieve them like that. I'll kill somebody, but I'm not going to go through their bag like that. I don't care. I'm not going to take, I'm not going to take your spotter scope out. Like, come on. Gaming huh? ethics have went down the drain. Like, dude, you can't Gaming a spotter episodes. scope. Be like, so that means when I come back, I don't have a spotter scope. So then basically the next time I get a spotter scope is the next time that I load in things. Or or here's the trick that you can do, though, too, that we've done. So if your friend has a spotter scope in that game, too, you can just hit, hit up a, a weapon box or whatever. And then it'll duplicate the, and you the just spotter the scope. Other one. Look at this, dude. We got this one again, man. This is great. I'm starting to learn things here. No one, no one said it was going to be fun. It's definitely a grind. 
if someone yeah i was trying to get my friend solar over here i think he i don't know what the hell he's doing he's uh i think he's I've playing he's playing on, a new game i've seen him on a lot you he, didn't he play pc for a long time he's, he's still playing pc he barely plays over here i swear I don't want to say what he goes by on the PlayStation, but I think I've seen him on. He's probably on right now. Who knows? He's in the he's in the same boat as like a lot of my friends though. They're just kind of done with GTA. Fair. It's honestly that's why I've been trying to get into like different games again. Man. Like, I, right. I suck at COD, but hey, it's something better to do than. I, I understand that the game, this game may be old, but this game is still like, this is a golden game. This is one of those games that came out in 2013. This is like a PlayStation 3 game, and it still stands up like today in 2024. Like everything, the graphics, everything still stand up like still today. Like it doesn't have like the worst graphics, like even on new gen. And they and trust me, like for graphics, they really didn't do much over here. Because if you compare this to like Red Dead Redemption 2 right now, like these graphics, these it, graphics are horrible. Didn't all they do was just like lighting? I, I I don't know. They they did some yeah some like maybe a texture pack or something like that. That's about yeah. it. They pulled a Minecraft on you guys, man. Yeah, they, did, like, <laughs> they pulled a Minecraft. Well, on actually, you, dude, yeah. I've seen I've seen some texture packs in Minecraft that make it look like that, pretty oh decent. God. Yeah. Like pretty decent. Like everything's looking pretty pretty nice over there compared to like. Cause like I think I had like one friend too. He's like, yeah, I won't won't play Minecraft because of the. I was like, it's actually a fun. It can be a fun game if you have like friends and all this other stuff. You guys are building worlds together and trying to survive. It's kind of it's like a survival game in a sense, you know. Well, it really is. You can do a lot of other stuff. I don't know. I, build, building I, I building game. I haven't played it in a long time. No, I haven't played it in a long time either. I don't, I don't probably yeah. ever go, plan on going back. Not not for ages. The only thing uh, me and my friends go back for is, uh, so for example, like, you can get, it's just technically a texture pack, but like, okay. there's now in-game Minecraft mods, and we'll go over there and like, oh, okay, let's go do some prop hunt for a little bit, you know? That yeah. That's fun, I will say, going to do that shit's very fun, excuse my language, but like... Mark 2. It, it, it. Need that on the close end. Oh, Winter Peyote Plan's coming back into the game? Uh, maybe for 420. I don't know, but we all, we always have a 420 thing going on. I can't uh, imagine I a... that they're gonna give us any drip feed probably until like the 420 thing, because like right I... now, dude, it's, it's almost April, and April 20th is coming up right around the corner. They're gonna have a weed week here in GTA. They've been doing it. They've been doing it for years now. And I, I thought I think it's just funnier than hell. I was like, you guys are actually celebrating 420 in a video game. Like that's hilarious in my mind. And like, and they're open about it too. Like they're open. Like they're just open about it too. Like we, like weed is totally acceptable, and so is shooting people in the face. <laughs> hey, it is where I live. I'll tell you that much. Well, uh, hold on, now. I gotta see where we have to go. I have a screenshot. Um, <sighs> I can send it to you. You don't have to check it out now, but uh. It's a screenshot of Chop running around with a grenade, and I am Chop. It's it was ridiculous on how it works. Yeah, there was another person when I was on PC too that I can remember. It was a fat chick, and she was like naked, like completely naked. How big you? How big you? I don't I don't know. And it was it was a naked fat chick, and every single time she she was running towards, she spawn. She like spawned towards you. I know this is a real player. And then she comes towards you and like as soon as she comes towards you, it it launches you like all the way across the map, like out into the ocean or something. And you're just, and now you're just stuck out in the ocean. <laughs> but uh yeah, it, that that wasn't like that wasn't um those people with mod, those are people with mod menus. That was an actual glitch that I I found out that you can actually run around and chop and throw grenades and sticky bombs and stuff. Oh yeah, throwables. Yeah, you can still do throwables yeah. with the RC, I believe. No, no, with Chop. I did it with Chop when Peyote Plains were out. Online. I can send you a screenshot of it real quick so you can just be proof of like Chop holding. No, yeah, I know, I know of the glitch. I think you can still do that. Um, you do yeah, it, but I don't, I don't know when the next time Peyote Plants are going to come out. No That's idea. Fair. It, it seems like these days they're bringing them out a lot more often, though. Like, now they're bringing them out for Easter, so you eat a peyote plant during Easter time, you're going to turn into a bunny, you know? 
Like they used to do. They used to be exclusive Halloween. Like, um, yeah, it, it used to be an exclusive Halloween thing. They only came out on Halloween. I thought that was like four years ago, though. That was a long time ago. All right, we're just gonna land this right here. Perfect. Uh oh. Uh oh. No, no, the fire's gonna. No. Fire's gonna blow up my Mark II. No. I don't know if you guys have ever been in a situation like that, but that's not good. Get this guy. Shotgun. No shotgun. I gotta kick him to death. <laughs> That's right. Fire rounds. Bendeco. <laughs> Anybody else? Anybody else here? <laughs> I'm catching the whole boat on fire. Oh, the whole boat's on fire. All right, now we go get the submarine because it's this one again. I don't know why it keeps giving it like the same one every time. Right, I need the submarine. <laughs> All right, here we go. Down into the depths of the darkness. Hold on, now we gotta get that. Right there. Pick it up. He's not doing it. What the hell? Is, what the hell is that thing flashing up there? What is that? Please say you found the cargo. Are those fish? Do you guys see that? What are those? Are they? Dead? Are they dead? <laughs> oh no, I can't. I can't get out of first person. Okay, there we go. We're looking good now. We're on the way back to the hang. Well, not back to the hangar yet, but we'll we'll be there soon. It wants me to drive, but I don't want to drive. not spend money what, what's this? no I spend lots of money man every single time I do like an LS car meet, okay. I'm, I'm dipping through at least 20 million maybe that's what 10, I'm asking 10, is like, 20. what did you do to grind 300 mil besides glitches like actual grind I, I think it's just uh just playing the game man honestly I play the game almost every day I think it's just and doing I, a lot of it's doing a lot of nightclub bunker and like coyotes. See, I don't bunker. I can't do bunker all the time, but like nightclub bunker is just a KO. cell mission, man. That's it. Yeah, but like uh, you don't have to grind. You just pay for it, whatever. And you're still making more profit than anything. I do auto shop, KO, bunker, warehouses. Don't do vehicle cargo. Do auto shop. Rarely do my salvage yard, and I stray away from hangar and bunker. You know, too, I think it is what at one point where, like, you get on this, uh, like, a money binge, you know? And mm -hmm. you're just like, <laughs> I just need more. I, feel I just like want to I just wanna I guarantee that I, I don't need any, I don't need I to, like, make any more money binges. before GTA 6. Like, do I need money? I don't need money, no. I, I can, like, give money away. Space. But I, I have money for modded cars, so we still got a lot of room for modded cars. So that's basically what my money is for at this point. Yeah, I do have a lot, though, I guess. I don't know. You do? No, that is... 
I guess is it's not that much. It's not as weird. much as like somebody could have. I mean, and I don't even grind as much as I as I really wanted to. Like if I really wanted to go on a money grind, dude, you've had this money since PS. Th you had this money since PS4 when I first met you. I, I, uh, <laughs> not not all of it. A think. good quarter of it though. You had a lot of money back on PS4, dude. Like one one week I met you, and like three weeks later you were already level. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I was like a hundred. <laughs> yeah, dude, like I, you, you had already passed me by margins. I just hit three hundred sixty something recently. Like, I don't, I have three thousand hours, and I still only have three hundred. I, I looked at it like a couple days ago. I'm like three thousand three hundred and seventy six hours. What's this dude doing? What are these people doing? GTA 5 AI. Ain't it the best AI in the world? <laughs> yeah, wait wait for GTA 6 because supposedly AI is going to be very much implemented in that one. <clears throat> no, I'm just saying, like, the driving and AI in, in GTA 5 is terrible. Well, they're talking about us being able to have conversations with AI, and that's going to be crazy. Like Red Dead. Like Red Dead. Like, actually just talk to them. That's what's up. Like, just talk, not Red have Dead choices. Like not have choices. Just, like, actually with an open microphone, just talk to them. And then they're talking to like three hours later, potentially, if you run into the same NPC, like they'll bring up something in the conversation that you talked about like three hours prior or something. I'm just like, that's scary. So you can be like nice or you can be like mean to NPCs. And then like, and then what? Like what happens when you like make an... I, oh, I died. They shot me. Yeah, maybe I shouldn't have used that for a getaway vehicle. Is it this dude right here? I'll take him out right now. I don't miss my throwing knives. You miss your throwing knives. I don't know what you're talking about. Reload the gun! Reload the gun! At least if uh, if you shoot all the people that, that are shooting at you from the from a buzzard, they won't be able to shoot you, dude. Cross the freeway, I dare you. See now the buzzard helicopter? Can't shoot me. <laughs> it's just gonna follow me. I usually do that sometimes too. You'll just shoot the people that are shooting at you and then the buzzard helicopters will just follow you around. There it goes back there. <laughs> it just landed and exploded. <laughs> what happened? Away from me. If you can just shoot either the the pilot or the, the front tire, you're good. Oh, the gas truck. Ha ha. <laughs> Here's a little rendering trick right here too, that you can do. I do that all the time. Yeah, I just keep know looking backward, about. and there's not going to be anybody in front of you to have to worry about. Is there? Big tip: if you have a far spot from a heist, use it during that, and you'll just be able to haul it down the highway. Do it all the time for you. Yeah, I made videos about this a long time ago. People didn't like understand. This is dude. This is this. It's not even. It's not a glitch. It's just how the rendering works. It's just how it's not just how rendering works. It's just how like basically all video, video games, games work. work. It's like how all video games work. People have even asked the question like, "Is this how real life works too?" I don't know. Drive a car and look behind you the whole time. Don't do that. <laughs> don't do that. Don't don't do that. <laughs> yeah, but you'll never be able to do that. Like you'll never be able to do that. You'll never be able to like see what's behind you. Like right now, potentially like, I don't know. There could be nothing behind me. 
So hold up. Wait, but, it is, that, but it only appears, mean... though, like, because it's the same render. It'd be like the same rendering as, like, a video game. So it only, it'd only render in because I'm there to see it, you know? Like, otherwise, it wouldn't even be there unless I, w unless I was there to see it. Like, that's how video games work, too. Like, like right, right now, there's, there's no Polito Bay. Polito Bay and Mount Chiliad and all that stuff, that's gone. That is not here It is anymore. literally non-existent. It has disappeared, and it is gone. The best, the best example you can say there is have a, have have anyone ever job jumped and seen like uh, horrible vectors? That, that's what he's talking about. That's what it is. You're not looking at something. That's all you see. It, it, that's all it shows practically. If you can see it, is it's, it's just unrendered textures. Yeah, I think Fortnite right now is like they've lowered their rendering or something like that. I think I can't remember. Yeah, they, my friend, they my friend was saying the something over in Fortnite. Like they actually see. lowered or something the rendering. So. You'll notice it in some games too. You'll like if you go into an area a little bit too fast, and you'll see things loading in. That's yeah. Because we don't have computing power necessarily. We just need better computing power, which you which will happen. Keep, trust me. You can't keep everything rendered in that that's like you're not looking at currently. That's too much computing power. The system can't handle it. Is. it. This is like this is one of the reasons why GTA probably runs so smoothly. It's because they got they got it like down over there. Like this is an old game, but it but it runs pretty smooth. It ran smoothly on the PS3, man. It ran smoothly on the PS3. Like unlike uh, some games, like dude, I used to play PUBG back in the day. Like dude, oh, you get horrible. to the ground, you dude, you land on the ground on PUBG, and like five minutes later, you still have like buildings loading in. You're just like okay. Or the ground's not even loaded in. Yeah, <laughs> like, the ground or the ground is like it's it's air, like yeah. it's loaded in, but it's like it doesn't have like a texture to it or something like the texture hasn't loaded in. Because they like they'll do these barriers and like the barrier then then they have to do like the texture, texturize it. Like way games work is interesting. Man. Booyah! I got another one done. Let's see how we're looking here. Almost three hours stream. Let's go. I got an ad. Wow, well, I got an ad, Grave. You got an you got an ad, huh? Yeah, on your stream. What kind of what kind of an ad? Because people were saying I got some pretty messed up ads on my on my I swear, channel. I swear I just got an Nvidia. Someone ad. someone got like a about? shoe ad or something for some girl shoes. He was like, I'm not even a girl. <laughs> I just got an Nvidia ad. Oh, Nvidia. Oh, that's cool. Yep, I just got one of those. That's a that's a good. Uh, that's a good graphics card. That's one of the major ones right there, actually. That's what, I, that's I what I'm rocking in my PC, PC right now is NVIDIA. All right, so during this whole time, it looks like we were only able to get 20 of these boogers. And I had a couple of people helping me at one point, too. So, well. Oh, let me let me see if Rooster's here. Rooster's supposed to help you, be helping me. It can take a long time, dude. This is why this is why I always tell people, dude, listen, if you're going to do this, you find like three other friends and make sure that they want to do like the same thing because everybody could fill up every dude, everybody could fill this up way quick if you had friends. That's the only problem though, like you need friends. Uh Rooster's not back yet. Is he just hovering in the sky over there? Who, Rooster? Yeah. He's oh, in a plane. Sure. Dude, I'm freaking stuck on a chair. All right, keep this going. I don't think it matters which one we go after, honestly, at this point. Um, for the for the second time that I do this, though, I'm probably going to be filling it up with nothing but one type of cargo. Just so I can get the, the bonus type. on it. I should probably just make a video about it, too. The types of bonuses. It can be it can be a lengthy grind. Yeah, it can be. I've been at this for a few hours, and I've only been able to collect, like, how many? It's You've been at it for... Yeah, I've been at this for, like, three... Well... Off and on, about a, kind about of, a like not, not a full, probably about a good two and a half hours or something like that. And I've been only able to get like whatever. So probably like five, a five hours or something like that. You could probably fill one of these up all the way. 
But if you had friends, you could do it in like probably, I'm thinking, an hour and a half. Where's my Mark II? I don't have my Mark II. Raja. There you go. And we got the good jet. Outplayed, outskilled. Oh my god. Alright, wheels in. And jetting. <laughs> yeah, this thing is nice. It's way better than the Hydra. Uh, I, I don't know if I did a video on it or not. I think I it's a lot have. faster. I was, compar uh, I was comparing this you? with the Hydra. Like the, the Hydra just sucks, I think. It's, it's too chunky of a vehicle. It's got like... It's got like a weight to it, you know? This one right here, this is like from freaking Blocky Martin Skunk Works. Don't know who that is? Those are the people that are making crazy things. Dude, I don't know. I could, I could talk you guys' ear off for a second about crazy, crazy things that I know. Because, like, they're working actually... with this one staff, too. And, like, they're talking about these spaceships and things like that, too. But I'm just telling you, like, spaceships right now are being made by, like, these companies. Ask, ask yourself this. How come the fastest airplane that we've ever made was, like, more than uh, 80, 90 years ago? <laughs> like, that was the fastest airplane that we ever made. I can't remember exactly what it's called, but it's, like, this, like the Stealth or something like that. It's, like, the B... Something like that. I don't know what it is. But it was made in, like, 1965. The Stealth Bomber? I don't know if it's a Stealth Bomber, but it's, like, the fastest airplane. It's something... It's like the Blackbird or something like that. It's like that Blackbird, I think, airplane that looks from, like, you know, uh, the X-Men movies, but it's not really that. It's kind of like the that. The SR-71 Blackbird. Something like that. I, I could, look, well, I could Google SR it, but I'm just saying. I like, just did. And, like, it, it was made a really long time ago. Yeah, over 2,190 miles per hour, it was the Lockhead SR-71 Blackbird. Yep. I just looked it up for you. And why wouldn't why wouldn't they freaking keep all this? Because they don't want in, their enemies to get a hold of this type of technology. That's what I'm telling you. And then zero point gravity technology too, to where we are we already have it. They're talking about too how freaking they have evidence that we've already we've already mastered gravity in about the 1940s, about 1940s or so. They've already mastered gravity. Like if you do like your research, like I've done, you'll find you'll find out all these very interesting pieces of documented historical events that have happened. You know, like with the Nazis and stuff, and the Nazis potentially like trying to work with aliens and get technology and build UFOs. And oh yeah, there's there's all this, there's all the. I'm not just talking. There's like this is all documented stuff. It's all documented in history, and like you know, written down, all that. Has it ap actually happened? You think we have cool technology? What about the technology that they're not showing us? You, you, oh, you don't think the military doesn't have better technology than like what we have? They've got crazy things, dude. Trust me, I've got a brother. It's been in the military his whole life. 20, 25 plus 30 years now. One of the one of the highest ups that he can be right now of where he is. He's told me things that he can't tell me. Basically, he says, "I know things that if I told you, I would seriously have to kill you, because of the uh, because of the national threat." He's like, "I'd have to kill my own brother. I'd have to take you out, bro." <laughs> you could try. Fine, add me to your CEO. Yeah, you can try, man. Yeah, because they have technologies and stuff. You can't have this out because there's other people out there that want these things potentially for like once again, because everybody's got it in their damn mind of some sort of world overworld freaking let's ru let's run the whole world the same way or something like that i'm telling you that's why someone said the other day en english is not the most 
like spoken language. I'm pretty sure it's uh, what is it? Spanish. No, it's not Spanish. It's something else. It's actually it's Muslim, I think. If I that's the right, for correct word for the language. Muslim, Muslimic or some shit, like something like that. Muslimic, I think. Anyways. I made a joke too, because they're because I think they were from Germany, and they're saying that German okay. German should be the 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 more spoken language upon the world. And I made a joke, and I was saying, well, it it would have been if you know the whole the whole World War II was in Hitler's favor, I guess. Hey man, that guy was strung That's... out on meth big time. Speed, yeah, he was yeah speed. He was a big old junkie. Taking injections all the time, all amped up on crack. You're fine, Speed right? was his thing, dude. That's what that's how that like what they gave everyone too. It's it's been a proven fact. Like that's what they gave like all the soldiers, and that's how they were able to take over everything so quickly. But over there, because they were hyped up on freaking meth. <laughs> all right, need an invite, dude. Yeah, man, send me a C invite. There you go. Oh, don't melee me. That's not very nice. You got you guys want to see some scary stuff. I'm telling you. You go go on the internet and look up look up like what they're doing right now with the robots. Look up look up see what like try to see what like what uh Elon Musk is doing right now with his robots. Dude, he's giving his robots guns, okay? That's that's not cool. <laughs> How long is it before we see an army of these things marching down the street with like freaking AK forty sevens or something and they have and they have auto aim friends? Because they're robots. Why wouldn't they give the robot auto-aim? You don't think a robot doesn't have auto-aim? They have auto-aim in video yeah. games. Why wouldn't they give them auto-aim in real life? Of course they'd have auto-aim. thought COD's aimbot was bad. They could take over the world with yet. robots, man. I'm telling you, we're looking at a Terminator-type situation in, at some point. we got to train now. <laughs> start, start hoarding food. <laughs> Touch up on, on how to kill Terminators. Just watch Terminator 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, and 7. <laughs> how many are how many Terminators are there? I don't know. There's like nine of the boogers now. They just keep getting worse too. Ugh. I'm gonna make myself cry. I was laughing. What what's that over there? Oh man. <laughs> I went to go look at my Chromebook and I thought I was the one picking the cargo. <laughs> the Swiss. <laughs> oh. <laughs> what? Yankton plates? What are you talking about? All I can say is let it go, dude. The game's like 11 years old. Who cares? <laughs> I've, ta I've talked about that before, too, about plates. So you tell me this. So when someone's driving past you, are you noticing what type of license plates they have on when they're going, like, 130 miles an hour and they, they, it, you, you see them for, like, one second? I don't think you do. I don't. Not not really one person, too, like, cares about that. Bumpers and things like that. No one cares about bumpers. It's, it's really crazy what people care about. I, this, this, I mean, honestly, on, on the, the real spectrum, this is what I would care about. Performance. Above anything, above I, I could I could have a piece of crap on wheels as long as that thing freaking has good top speed acceleration and performance, and I can guarantee you if I made a piece of poop on wheels, everyone would want one because they'd be like, oh, you got a modded piece of poop on, yeah, because that's how people operate over here. They already did that with the Go Go Monkey blister. That's a piece of crap on wheels. Uh, well, I'm just saying, like something. Say. I'm just saying, like if it, if it was super fast, like dude, I'm, and I'm telling you, if it's PC, someone's probably already done it. I was like like a poop, poop emoji car or something. I'm telling you, the, I bet someone's already done it. Rig. You can rust it and throw. Up. Uh, they do crazy things on PC. I've seen cars made out of cardboard on PC. There is a car on PlayStation that has like cardboard. There is a cardboard stuff. car on GDA. Yeah, yeah, I use it all yeah. the time. Yeah. Oh, my pinball no, I'm, yeah. So I'm, I'm saying like the, the actual car for PC was like actually made out of cardboard. So like when yeah, you hit a jump, cardboard. when you hit a jump with that car, because the car would weigh nothing, you know what I'm saying? 
like it would just go flying or if somebody ran into it it would just absolutely just smash it to to undescribable you know means because they made it to where like the car was actually it, i'm pretty sure they have one on pc yeah but i was talking about the the destructibility of it like the mod the modding of the car so. where do we have to go again polito oh my god Predicted. Yeah, any day, any day now. I'm just waiting for Rockstar to like email me or give me or text me on my phone or something like that. I'm willing to talk to them. G Money, you heard about that, right? No, I did not. Uh, Rockstar hired employees to to talk to GTA players, like in game, for a whole hour. A whole hour, if you can believe that. So there's a survey that you can fill out right now on Social Club, and if you fill it out, it's only like a few questions. You can get a quarter of a million dollars for free. I, I thought that. I thought that was for only PS5 players. I don't think so. I'll have to look into it. I know I know that right now they're they have players or they have people that are like I don't know and I don't know how they're doing this. I really don't. I don't know if it's gonna be like, can I get your do you have a phone number or or what you know type deal or. Yeah, I got the email the other day, two days ago. If, what is it going to be like? Or if it's going to be a, a phone call? Or if they're just going to hit you up like in a session or something like that? I'm, I'm just saying I, I would I would be a perfect person for them to talk to As a matter of fact you guys just might want to think about hiring me over there because I got so many good ideas <laughs> just put me on the team just just let me get on board here Matt, let me talk to your manager That's great. yeah this is gravesite you guys know you me right heard of me? yeah <laughs> you guys, oh, you guys going down I, I'm down. We'll have to all start a campaign with posters and banners and stuff like that. I, I think at one point, though, like if I went a certain way, they would just hang up on me. And another thing. <laughs> do, do you have a strong arm? <laughs> yeah, go find the person that invented the Mark II oppressor and punch them. I wasn't happy about that. Give the dude who nerfed it a high five. <laughs> give the dude who nerfed it a high five. Even well, though, it, you can't nerf. tell me that the Mark II oppressor didn't ruin a big aspect it, of no, online because it, it did. It did. It it's it totally did. I would. I don't care if people think it's a good vehicle. I think it's a good vehicle, no. but is it a good vehicle for a freaking a PVP type game? No, it's not. It's a it's a freaking seen... flying bike with missiles. Come on. I seen a Reddit thread the other day about how people want the the MK2 to be unnerfed, and it's like, okay, dude, like you clearly have not played the game that long. I'll I'll just throw this out there too. If you need a Mark II oppressor to go like get kills, dude, you suck at the game. If that's the only way that people can get kills is like with with freaking auto aim missiles, then I'm sorry, you're not good at the game. I come from the days where we used to roll around on foot back in the days when there wasn't even like sp spamming rockets. That's why I don't PVP in this game anymore because of all the tactics that people result to. Okay, so you're telling me even after Rockstar got rid of KD, people are still killing themselves? Okay, then I'm not, I'm, there's no point in fighting anybody then if that's what everybody's gonna do. Like, you're serious. That's, that's dumb. Just take the L, bro. Got room on there for me and right on the handlebars. <laughs> I gotta get one, dude. I blew up my jetpack there. I don't know what happened. Yeah, I gotta get the old Mark II again. Dang it. No, I crashed my jet in the freaking. Oh my god, what did I just do? I just called Merryweather? What did I ask for? Oh, I asked for munitions. 
For some wheels? I'm yeah, so, uh, Rick, I don't know if uh, that you. counts for the stuff. Let's get this package real quick. No, I don't reckon it does, hey. So, I reckon complete load of crap. That's okay. Yeah. It's gonna take me about but at least we know. That you think that it would. Like, I don't know. The whole Absolutely. $50 million thing, too, that's Shoot. a bit ridiculous. Because if you, if you do the math on that, like, just do the math on it. It doesn't add up. No. It does not no. add up. A thousand crates don't add up. Yeah, the, a thousand crates don't add up. Where's the box? Back here? Oh, it's back here. I passed it, dig it. Where is it? It's not, it didn't disappear again, did it? No, it's still on the map for me, so just walk around in that general area. Oh, I got there it. No, go. it was. It was like, that's weird, dude. So, if you, yeah, if you blow up that vehicle or whatever, and sometimes, like, they're invisible. Like, I can see them on my mini map, but they're not there. Like, GTA for you. Yeah, whoever blows the vehicle up in a, in a group, whoever blows it up is the one that can see them, and no one else can see them. Oh, that's good to know. I didn't know that. Didn't I didn't know, know that either. Yeah. You know, how many hours do you have on this game, Greg? Uh, on this account? I don't know. It's a lot. I, I've see. played a lot more than just on this account, though. That's the thing. I know. Because you, I, I, you have to... Uh, for, for a bit there, I do play on PC. Uh, I, I, and I, can ju I can jump into RP at any point. I want to go jump into RP again. Because yeah, it's, just... it's really fun. Just talking, talking to console, people, just talking uh, crap to people, dude. It's just the funnest thing. I have to be in the right type of mood for it, though. You have to be in a troll a little mood, bro. I'm at just over 8,000 hours in the game. Yeah, I'm, I'm sitting at 3,000 right now. Which is a lot. 8,000 is huge. I, my dad is 9,000. I think somewhere yeah. around there. Nine. Yeah. Yeah, I've got two other accounts. Yeah, it'll oh, probably God. be like that for GTA 6, too. Well, yeah, especially since, like, I'm old enough to, like, go in there and buy the game myself on, like, GTA 5. So, yeah, I'm going to have a lot of hours in that game. You gotta, you got to be 21 <laughs> to buy GTA 6. <laughs> Kill me now. It's going to be hardcore continue. nudity or something. Actually, I wouldn't be, doubt I'll it. Be, I wouldn't doubt it in a game like that. About it. Dude, that's what people were hating on, too. There were so many people hating on, like, the some sort of sexual aspect about the game or something like that. And like, oh, and this is what kids are da 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 It's like, physics. the game is rated M, okay? Okay, Jiggle you have to be physics. like 18 That's years every... old, potentially, where I live to like even buy the game. So like, and dude, how, do, they... how do kids even get GTA 5? Because their parents are buying it for them, dude. Yeah. Like, come on. The, everyone's afraid of the jiggle physics. It's really what it is. Like, <laughs> if I had a little kid, physics. I don't think I'd ever want them playing GTA, dude. Nor Fortnite. Nor Fortnite. Just no, nothing. None of those toxic games. I'd have to like issue like games or something. Or like, or how about this? Just no games at all. How about just go outside like, and play? Do what I did when yeah, I was a kid. Yeah, for a while. But like for me, it's like man, like yeah, I'll, I'll let you play like Minecraft and like games that are not online. Because like, dude, when you go on the online community, it's not what you think. It is. I, think like, I remember that when I was a kid. I don't know. I feel like Minecraft is a good game for kids to play. Uh, it it is, and it's been a proven fact. It helps. Uh, it helps with a lot of Creative, um, creativity. They they play Minecraft at Thanks. schools in Australia. I'm I'm, yeah. I'm from Oz, so and they actually play it at school as part of their curriculum. Yeah. Yeah, it's because it, yeah. it it sparks creativity. Absolutely. Yeah. Yep. Uh, yeah, yeah. With being in it with. You know, innovative right now in the way that 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 we are with games, because games right now, dude, games right now, like it's crazy the way that like in in my in my mind, like games are, have have taken over entertainment. Like it's basically games over everything yeah. right now. Games have have taken over, like basically like the movie industries and things like that. Like movies right now and actors, they're not they're not probably gonna get as as paid in, in, as much as like as much money as they're dumping into video games these days. Like think about that, wanna... like. $2 billion got dumped into GTA 6. Do you think that they're ever dumping $2 billion into a movie? No, because they're never going to see that type of revenue behind it. You know what I'm saying? But like, I why would a video like... game dump $2 billion? Because their revenue is, is going to be it's like $20 billion off of it at yeah. least. If they, made, if they made $18 billion off of GTA 5 in the last 10 years, 
then in the next 10 years, the company is only going to get more. So like, I would just say, if you're looking to buy some stock in a company, I'm pretty sure Rockstar would be almost a for sure bet. Unless you honestly think that GTA 6 is going to be a flop. I've heard people talking about that too. I shut them, real, I shut them down real quick on Twitter. I just say S S T F U B. <laughs> just shut up. I... Shut up. The game's not going to be crap. Bring bring this bring these two facts up to anybody that says that GTA six is going to be crap. Bring up the fact that was G was GTA five crap? Or how about this? What what about Red Dead Redemption two? How how crappy was that game? You know, like these are these are both triple A games that are like you know, pretty amazing. Open world experiences and all this all this awesomeness. Yeah. All right, we're going to go get some more narcotics. Red, Red Dead is downright amazing. It's an amazing game to play. <clears throat> Just the uh, graphics I, and everything in it is, is story awesome. Story mode is amazing. I, I will always... Story mode uh, was epic. Yeah, <laughs> yeah I, I will... I And, like, it's not that I hate on Red Dead. Red Dead is a great game, but... I will never. I there's don't. There's some. There's I, some pretty I, bad griefing going on online, though. Yeah. Yeah, and it's just online. It just it didn't. It, it didn't play out like they were. Not even like they were hoping. It. It, it was a test to test their. Yeah. Now story is absolutely epic. I ended, I platinumed um, Red Dead, and yeah, no. Yeah, just the pro process of that was epic. I got like I want to say I got like 84 percent of like my, my story precision since it's done, and it's like okay, like yeah, I I don't. I love this game. I've done multiple endings on it, but like, I can't just sit here and constantly grind that. I I, I just can't do it. I can't bring myself. No, to I I got I got right stuck into it. Um, like I said, got all the platinums for a hundred percent of everything. So yeah, I just didn't play around. Like it makes me want to go back and play a Red Dead One because I was too young when Red Dead One came out, and then GTA Four and Five were already out when I was like getting into gaming. Dude, so right now really for play, like PlayStation Five, they want like fifty bucks for for that. I can get that yeah, game. Nah, I can I... get that game for free. All I need to do is fix my PS3 and I can play it. Like... Nope. I I never got to play Red Dead One. I was always thinking about doing it, but if I do do it, I'm yeah. I'm straight up I'm doing it on PC because. That's fair. I'm, I'm just saying. That like, you can do graphic enhancers on there, man. Game. You can make the graphics look better. Well, and it, it has an online experience too. That's the thing. Yeah. I played online back in the day. I did. Like, you actually get to play online with that. And you get zombies, too, which is really cool. Undead Nightmare? Yeah. All right, I'll be Pretty right awesome. back. I'm gonna I'd almost like to do something with that, minutes. man, just because of the... What is that? In the back of the house? Just fly right in here. Grab this. Get the crate, so I don't have to get off the Mark II oppressor. Oh, come on now. we got to worm our way out of here. Don't get shot. All right, we're out. We're good. That one's one of the more easier ones. Oh, it just crashed. Somebody put a tree here. It must be a brand new tree of the last DLC, because I don't remember that tree being here before. Yep, new tree they added in the DLC. Crazy. Well, that was a hairy situation. Yeah, we're probably gonna end this soon. I've been doing this for a minute. I need to make I need to make myself some food before I do things like this. Yeah, there's a biggest one though too. The clock and bell one is still working too. Like people can make a lot of money off that. Uh, my friend G Money too. He said that uh, there was like what he made like forty million just off of the the clock and bell farm raid. Pretty easy, especially like right now. All you have to do is disorganize crime, and then you're onto the you're onto the deal. Yeah, sad thing about it too is like I don't need money. <clears throat> don't need the money. And my best guess is I'm I'm thinking two more DLCs. That's all we're getting here. We're probably getting two more DLCs, and that's it. I wouldn't be surprised that more they're gonna have to take more stuff out of the game too to even fit these two DLCs in. I'm like, what's it gonna be? They're gonna be able to give us North Yankton? I don't think they're ever gonna give us North Yankton because North Yankton was already a DLC that they were making for story mode, and they canceled all. There was like several or nine like DLCs I think that they were making. One of them was zombies too. We know that for a fact. 
Like, one of the DLCs that they were making for that was actual zombies. <clears throat> that would have been that would have been cool for GTA. <laughs> He's using the Hydra. Yeah, you had one cell truck over there. It seems like uh, over here, I got freaking the ca the cars every time. I'm moving. After I do this cell mission, because you have to get rid of all your stock anyway. So after I do this cell mission, we're going to do like a cell mission right now, I think. Let me get close to get this done. We're going to do another live stream tomorrow. Tomorrow, we're going to be doing um, trading modded cars for a few hours. That's for sure. I want to get see what other people have and try to get cars off of them. Share what I have for modded cars, stuff like that. Please stop calling me Ron. I don't like it. It's harassment at this point. You can't keep you can't keep calling somebody. That's illegal where I live. Okay, how do I know this? Cause I've done it with a couple girlfriends. <laughs> I would say ex-girlfriends, if you know what I mean. <laughs> oh dang it! I didn't mean to do that. Okay, we're gonna do one more, then we're gonna do a cell mission. My bad. Sorry. I'm like freaking spacing out. I got low, I got low blood sugar. I'm getting hungry. Well, it's a proven fact when you get hungry, you can't think straight. So, oh, this one's easy, dude. Easy peasy. Easy. You just follow, follow the green stream. Is he doing hydra speed? You doing hydra speed glitch? You see that thing going up and down? I'm pretty sure that was not, that one still works. The Hydra speed glitch. That thing could go fast, dude. You can get like across the city, dude. The Hydra speed glitch goes so fast. You can launch missiles at the Hydra when you're when you're doing the speed glitch, and you don't even you won't even get hit by the missiles because that's how fast you're going. You're going faster than missile speed. Okay, yeah. After this, we'll do a cell thing because I think I have I gotta go eat dinner soon. Gotta go eat some supper. So I get tired of the whole sleeping and eating all the time. It's boring. I'd rather just be like a robot. Go, go, go. I mean, you miss out on a lot of stuff. I think I know where it is. It's down here. Down here and around the corner. Nope, not there. Hold on. There it is. Time to meet your maker. And we're out of here. Yeah, because if you're only getting one truck over there, I'd rather I'd rather do that one, dude, potentially, because that might be a little bit better. Although if you get the ones right here in the city, that's pretty it's pretty straightforward. That it seems though like a lot of the times though when you're with people or something like that, you might send you out way out into Polito Bay. Same thing. Not just out in Polito Bay, but you gotta go out there and go to the ocean and then get like a stupid crate. Mm, I don't like that. I don't like it. I don't like it at all. <clears throat> yeah, apparently I'm ready for GTA 6, but GTA 6 isn't ready for me. <laughs> we have to wait. That's okay, man. That's all right. We got lots of lots of games still to play before. There's a lot of games out there. Still gonna be doing GTA. Yeah, like I said, I'm I'm going with GTA until the wheels fall off on this one. Ooh, it is getting late, isn't it? Okay. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, it is. I didn't realize it was so late. Yeah. Yeah, I'm going to go do this cell mission anyways, I think. Well, because I got like a thousand, a thousand of these boogers to freaking take care of. It's over there. Yellow circles right there. <laughs> what is he at? He's trying to land? Oh.
I know there was a time, dude, you could put freaking cars inside of your hangar and stuff like that. I've had cars inside my hangar. But at one point, too, I had my Mark II Oppressor over here at my, at my hangar. So you could, like, call up your Mark II Oppressor. It would say, like, it's like a different vehicle or something. But if you call it up, it'd be like, all right, let's do a cell mission real quick, I guess. We got enough crap here. Whatever. This is this is the day's grind. Appreciate the help, Rick. And everybody else that helped. And everybody that's in the stream. Just get, getting done with a, a Monday. Got some videos coming out after this, probably. Yeah. Some things I'm working on. Uh, um, source. Source it up. No, no, sell. Sell. We're selling. We're going to sell all of them, too. Selling all this stuff. We're gonna You're almost lean. halfway there, Grave. Lean is going to be better. Hey, up for some off roading? I got a couple of drop off points for a buyer that wants everything delivered out in the wilderness. Just make the drops. They'll come pick up. You're a little yeah, so here, so here's the big difference right here. It looks like between the city. So Rick, Rick got like one, one machine or what is it? One, yeah, one delivery vehicle, and it's like we have to deliver where? How many? I'm not seeing where we have ten to go. drops. Yeah, that's that, okay. So the, if that's how it is, always over here. After this, I'm changing. That's why I want to get rid of the stock because I'm gonna change it back to the. Uh... Yeah, screw this one. I'm gonna change it back to the military base after this because I don't want to. I'm not doing this one anymore. I'll just switch it up. It'll be fine. Hey, at least they gave us some uh, some decent vehicles here. We got the I think this is the Retel. This is actually uh, better than the the trophy truck, which the trophy truck was like one of my favorite off-road vehicles for a while until they brought this in. Because this thing's like way faster, way better. Like, would I want to own one of these in real life? Yeah, I would. Take this thing out to the desert or something like that. Freaking tear through the wasteland. We put some uh, put some sand tires on this. Take it to the beach. Oh yeah, and by the way, uh, you don't need multiple vehicles for doing this. You just you could do this with like one vehicle. Yeah, the main reason though I want to change back is because it seems like every single time you're over here at the LSIA, you're gonna be getting multiple drops. Like you're gonna get the ten the ten stop drop like every single time. But over there at the military base, you have a chance of getting the um, the one vehicle where you just have to take the one vehicle to one spot. It's a lot easier. It's a lot faster. It's a lot better. A lot easier. Yeah, now let's just hope, too, that, like, if for GTA 6, if they plan on implementing career challenges into the game, that they do it early on and they don't do it, like, you know, doing everything so late. Dude, that's another thing. But at this point, I'm a little bit weary of doing any type. Dude, I'm going to have multiple accounts over on that one because let me, let me just tell you this. Like, I'm going to have one account... I'm not going to do any glitches with, and then there's, there's going to be like another account or a couple of them that I'll be doing glitches with because I, I don't know at this point. Like, you're going to get banned. Just imagine getting banned like the first couple of weeks of playing GTA 6 and you don't even get to play it. You have to go make like another account or something like that and start all over or something. How lame. Just because you want to cheat. Oh, I've done some cheating. That's for sure. I know. I know that's how I got a lot of my money. Uh, duplicating cars, I think, and selling them. Doing replay glitches. Dude, 
I think I went off road the wrong, wrong spot here. Alright, we should go over this way then, I think. Gotta look at my map. Okay, so there's a string of them right there. Okay, and then I'm gonna go up for these then. The one's more off to the right. Yeah, great off-road vehicle. This thing's pretty awesome. You guys don't own a Rattel, you might want to think about getting one at some point. I got I got one that's modded. Sick. What color? It's green. Love green. Alright, we're doing a saw mission right now. That's fucking awesome. Thanks. I don't even see any smoke yet. Like, okay, right there. That's what I was looking for. I was like, where's the smoke, man? I should be seeing smoke at any point now. It's the yellow, the yellow stuff. All right, finally, got to one. All right, so the next one is gonna be over here, I think off to the right. Yeah, back in the day, me and my friends and stuff like that, we used to do a lot of off-roading here in the hills. You get to the you get to the parts where like um, you do a lot of jumping. Yeah, I don't want to get out right now and shoot those dudes that are shooting at me. Where's that, dude? It's like up here or what, man? What's, did I miss one? I'm, I don't even know if I'm going the wrong, the right way or not. It's right there. I know that, but I don't know if I missed one on the way here. All right, where's the next one? All right, left. We got to go left down this way. While we're getting shot by helicopters. Woo! That's always something I appreciate in video games and some air time. Dude, I just got shot in midair. Did you see that? Yeah, there's no way that they don't have freaking auto-aim, those bots. Robots. No, oh, I'm getting lit up here. Oh, my God. Hey, at least the cargo doesn't fall out of the back. Huh? It's, it's secure. It is definitely secure. Gotta love this vehicle, though. This is a good vehicle. I'm telling you. Definitely want to buy this one. I didn't know how far down the freaking mountain I have to go here. So that's why I was like, how far down the mountain do I have to go? Shoot me while I'm in here. Okay, it's like right here. And there's like more over there. Can't see the best. Where? Where's the smoke? Oh, right there. Yeah, because it's nighttime. You can see it better in the daytime. All right, we got more. Where's the more? This way? I don't know. The helicopter is like just annoying, dude. I'm seriously just about ready to. It's just like a freaking a, a fly. You are like buzzing fly. <laughs> The rat catcher. Oh, what was that? There's a coyote. <laughs> this is a good off-road vehicle. 
All right. Did we miss anywhere? Are we good to go? I think I got four and Rick got six, so Rick beat me. I, I tried to get five. Five? How many did I get? I only got... Did I get four or did I get five? I don't remember. I try to make it equal. I don't like other people doing more work than I do. You think you're better than me? You can deliver more crates? Oh, I'm gonna go into the river! Back it up, buddy. Back it up. <laughs> Yay! We did it. Now, where's the helicopter? Shoot it. <laughs> I don't know where it is. <laughs> Look at the trees in the way. Dude, we get to like keep these vehicles or what? That's awesome. <laughs> Why did that guy drive down there? What's that dude doing? Hey Rick, big thanks and big thanks to everybody here for the stream. I think at this point we've been doing this for three hours and 40 minutes. We're gonna be doing oh, more live man. stream tomorrow. Sorry, We're gonna be doing give uh, modded or the modded car thing tomorrow. Yeah, we get to keep these vehicles. They're ours forever now. <laughs> after you after you do a give cars to friends glitch or something. Hey, I didn't even do anything, man. I got three stars. Hey, you want to get into a gunfight? This is it right here. This is the place. This is for Princess Bubblegum! <laughs> Revenge! Revenge! Because the cops killed Princess Bubblegum and I was gonna kill them too. <laughs> what, you don't like Princess Bubblegum? You get out of my stream right now. She's great. She's got her own cartoon and everything. Japan animation. Yeah, I think we're gonna dip out though at this time. I'll be back later. I don't know if you're gonna be on or anything like that. We'll be back in just a little bit. I gotta go eat some food and stuff like that. Because I haven't done that in a minute. Really appreciate the help, man. Seriously. Yeah, that sucks that uh, whatever. So if you need some help with yours at some point, I'll be helping you too. Especially yeah, when you're going, if you're going yeah, after like the, the, the one crate thing, you know what I'm saying? Because I think I'm gonna do that next. Yeah. I'm gonna move my I'm gonna move my hangar to the military base, and then I think this next run that I'm gonna end up doing is probably gonna be like I'm not calling rooster. I'm just going either going after chemicals or narcotics because either one of those is going to be the 70% bonus. Because like what I said before, yeah, like... that last sale was 2.5 that I did, so... Okay, well that probably would add up a bit more if you had... Okay, so... Yeah. Yeah, and that, that was all narcotics. I remember you asking before, but... Uh, yeah, it was a bit busy. Yeah, it's narcotics, it, narcotics or chemicals. I know that those are the top two right there. I mean, all the other ones will get you bonuses too, but those are the... Like, for some reason, they made the, car the narcotics and the chemicals... Because I actually have, like, a sheet somewhere that says, like, all the bonuses that you'll get. And, like, the worst ones that you'll still get, like, a 30% bonus or something like that. But, of course, you'd want to yeah. be going after the one. I mean, if you're going to do it for the whole thing, you're going to want the 70% bonus. And then on top of that, you could potentially, like, do that in a public session. Have like, you got if, you the, did, uh... if you did that on a public session, like, we probably could have made it there without getting blown up. Yeah, like, this is what the... I learned, too. Like, you just do go into a fresh, a fresh have... session tier three have you got all the tier three yet still 50 crates of the same type of air freight cargo i did i have have you got that one that's, th that's what i was getting today oh that's, that's the one you got today okay right on that's yeah, what you're going after yeah, yeah so, so at some point it looks like you actually have to go through there and get 50 crates of one thing but yeah it doesn't help it doesn't hurt like having people help you and stuff like that too. selling and pubs if yeah i appreciate the help start the VIP work headhunter, it will cover your cargo and just show you has an icon on the map and not a cargo dot. Wait, what? So, you know the headhunter VIP work? Mm-hmm. You start that, like, you have a friend in your lobby, and they start it at the same time you start your, your cargo, and it covers your cargo up on the map, and it just shows your icon, like your dot. We abuse that all the time on PS4, so we can sell nightclub cargo and pubs. Oh, like in a public yeah. session, and then nobody yeah, would kind of... Yeah, because the headhunter takes priority, doesn't it? 
Yep. Headhunt, headhunter takes priority. It doesn't. It doesn't mess up your cell, but it just makes it where no one can see your um, your cell on the map. Well, that's it's a nice really little. Useful. That's a nice little trick. I should be like. I'm, I, sh I should like do that here soon and show people that one. The timing's hard to get, but I've gotten it a couple times and it's very useful. Oh, timing is hard to get. Okay, so it's yeah. basically What's like the... you have to start at the same time as like your friend or yeah, something, and then. You do. Uh, all right. What's the maximum number of uh, crates you can get? Like, because you can do crates with, with an MC, and I think what an MC tops out at eight or ten people. So, will you get eight or ten crates if you have a full MC? I don't. I don't. I've never tried that. I know the most I think that you Either. can get is like four. I thought. If you get, well, if you can MC, hire yeah, eight MC people, that'd be crazy. Eight. Good luck trying to get that an many MC people though. Pop out at eight. That's not a bad idea. Because I used to, when the Savage Art glitch came out, I used to run um, an MC of eight people, and everyone would be getting paid a mil each. Most broken glitch I've ever done. The alternative is get uh, free, a few mates who either have already got the challenge, or who aren't interested in the challenge, to source some cargo, and then you just steal their cargo off them. That's not a bad idea, though. Yeah. Yeah, that would be like another thing I guess that you could do too. Yeah, if you had a lot of if well, yeah. If you had a lot of people, like you could potentially just have everybody go out and just start getting crates. You know, just do like one one thing. Just fill up a lobby full of like 30 people and have everybody just do like Wouldn't one mission better? and then like bam, dude, there's like 30 crates like right there. Everyone have the same hangar or know where your hangar is out. Everyone start it up. They deliver their cargo to your crate, ego themselves or leave the vehicle there and you can just nonstop turn it in. Yeah, you could probably do it's that. Just you know, that, that's a lot of coordination and people though oh yeah i do it with business battles and like my homies lobbies we usually run like an eight nine ten man deep so we're yeah, always that's what just, I do. yeah we're just running a, 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 a ten deep crew and everyone everyone's on the same page we're a very uncoordinated group but when it comes down to it we can coordinate really well yeah yeah, at some point, that's what i was hoping to because uh here like sooner than later i'm i'm starting some I'm starting some uh, heist challenges. I'll probably like, you know. Um, I have a crew set right now. We're uh, we're currently working on um, criminal mastermind of the apartment and doomsday. Doomsday two, three, four loyalty bonuses, and then criminal mastermind for the apartments. And I want to say loyalty bonuses for the um, <clears throat> apartment. I don't too. think it's too tough. You just need people all no, on the same page. Like the but the no. toughest yeah. part yeah. about I, it I is do. just finding everybody to get like on the same page and everybody's dedicated I did doomsday like... that was the doomsday was fairly fairly easy it, yeah i figured it would be as long as you can get act three down man act three is the only one that's like punishing if you if you mess up the hacks it's over you might as well just reset uh yeah i'm lucky on yeah that the one hack too. the hack isn't even the issue with act three i think honestly the yeah the rapid fire glitch is the issue with it where one of the bad guys will just light you up and kill you in a second that's fair that's probably that's probably the worst part about it I reckon. Honestly, just like most of the rooms that you have to you have to clear is like, see, and I can do it a two man, and the only thing when we, me and my homie did it, the only thing we missed out on is we were like off by like twelve headshots, and it's like okay, so next time we do it, we're just gonna go hit twelve. Like, we're gonna double our headshot amounts that we're gonna do. So like, he when we were doing the hacky part, he was like, oh, like I have to protect him, so just kill everyone it is. Well, no, when the hacker's actually on the hack, he cannot be shot at or damaged. So you could just sit there and focus yourself up and just headshot, headshot, <laughs> headshot, headshot. It's really broken. Yeah, I did the I did the elite on all three and then did uh, mastermind uh, two, three, and four for Doomsday. I started yeah, I on uh, the apartments, but I just had people flake out on it. And once they flake out, especially right in the middle of it, it kind of sucks. You have to start oh, over yeah. again. Yeah, that reset. Yeah. So. Um, and those are yeah. like the apartments are like people. People probably think. They're some people I know they're like, oh, you know, they're, they're the OG heist now, man. They're, gonna they're actually decently hard. Like, they're not like, I wouldn't say like bogged in Act Three hard, but they are hard enough where it's like you don't want to, you don't want to go in there thinking it's just going to be a stroll in the park because it's not. It will not be. No, most definitely not. No. You main labs and Pacific Standard. Like, there's a there's a tactic Pacific Standard heist. Um, you can go. And shoot, I want to say, you just, like, shoot towards the, like, the, the door, and it, it fails. 
But since you're technically not dying by the pack standards like challenges, you're not allowed to die. So since you're failing without dying, you'll be able to continue on and have elite challenge so possible. So you're not wasting the time from getting from point A to point B. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. So practically I've, resets yeah, your time at the door. Yeah, right. Yeah, there's a bunch of tricks and, and oh, yeah. stuff like that you can do for all of them. I, I'm not really well versed in the apartment ones, but I've fairly got the doomsday ones down. Uh, the apartment ones can be really easy as long as oh, you yeah. just have a team of people that knows exactly the same things. That's why, like, I was almost wanting to, when I go back to do, like, the highest ones, I'm just going to go through and, like, show people exactly what to do on every single mission Keeps to where everything. nobody dies. It's, you know what I'm saying? Like... Yeah, that'd be like right. sometimes right. you don't even need it, like all the people. You just need like one person like that knows what they're doing. Hey, Grave, let me take your um, let me take your bounty. Wait, technically, by that, by that, uh, why do you need tier it? Four, <laughs> that let tier me, four, let me take your bounty. You got a bounty. Just be, wouldn't that practically just be like okay. do elite challenge? It's okay. Do elite challenge and you're good. Complete the diamond casino heist in under ten minutes. That's probably going to be it. the aggressive way right there. I still have that Do one, the too. aggressive, yeah. yeah. Oh, I did. I... See, it's funny. I did mine silent and sneaky. <laughs> oh, really? I, I, did learned... all, I did all the elites for um, the casino, and the aggressive one was, I thought, were the most annoying because you've got to get heaps of headshots, and there just isn't yep. enough bad guys. You've got to kind of farm bad guys that without and big cards letting really that timer fun. run out. Yeah. Big cards so. are really fun. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, for sure. That's going to be a tough one, though, right there, too. I'm going to have to get, like, a couple of my friends set up with some replay Wait, glitches once again for that one. It's just hard It's just hard to get some of my that? other friends because, just like what I said earlier, like, they're just kind of, like, done with GTA. Like, they just don't care you anymore. You have to get Diamond for that. How would that be possible? <clears throat> uh, what's that, like, sorry? You'd have to wait. He would have to. So, for the challenge he's looking at, still all variations of loot. The, yeah, I've got Diamonds ready to go. Oh, okay. So that okay. That's oh, I didn't even notice. So I can I can, yeah, I can I help out three that. dudes. I can help out three dudes with that. Um, basically, when I saw that they were coming up in a, on a, as an event week back in Valentine's Grinded Day, um, no, I didn't actually. What I did is I, I I actually reset the heist and then I went and uh, scoped out the casino all over again. I couldn't find anyone to actually finish the heist with me because I had gold sitting there ready to go. Um, well, but I just is, um... I just cancelled the heist and then uh, rescoped out the casino, got diamonds straight away, and that's all I've done is I've just scoped it out, got diamonds, and I'm just waiting for the opportunity his, to sort of do that with someone. You have to do it on so. hard mode without being detected. That's what I've got on hard mode. Yeah. So that's amazing right yeah. there. That's like a perfect setup for you, man. Yeah, yeah, I've got diamonds ready to go because I knew that they're an event week. So and I've got um, I've got Panther as well at um, Kaya Perico. Is is a yacht life worth doing? Is it actually fun? I've never touched those missions. I did the tier four challenges for um, your life solo. Um, okay. It was challenging by yourself. Yeah, I was gonna say but, I um, I don't have five, so I don't like the career progress is like non-existent. Yeah, one it's, of the best just... ways to do a lot of these things too is to just literally just piggybacking off of somebody if you have the chance. Yeah, yeah. Well, I I, I like like what you're like what you were saying before, not you, Grave, the other fella. Um, a lot of people have just dipped out of. Uh, GTA, oh, so yeah. it's just hard getting people to do it. So it is. Yep. people that I had, I had a, a big group of friends that used to play it. Now they just don't. You have to so, have like yep, four people here. that are dedicated to the grind nonstop. A lot, of, a lot of my yeah. friends like, look, man, I'll, yeah. I'll see you in GTA Six. <laughs> yeah, I have, no, I'm, he's like, I'm, we know you're going to be there. He's like, I'm dipping so out on I'll GTA. Just, I'll have, grind it out. Like, I'm just done. I have three yeah. people that are like nonstop. Like, okay, like I, I've been hit up like probably like three times a day. Like, hey, like. When are we going to start practicing for Criminal Mastermind? It's like, well, my homie just got suspended today from PlayStation, so, like, we can't practice yet. I was like, but as soon as, soon as like, he's back on, bam, we're going to start practicing it nonstop. And, like, it's going to be horrendous. I'm thinking about streaming it just to, like, show the idea of, like, the, the, the practice. Like, you're going to want to practice it. You're not just going to run and, you know, one and done. It's not possible. You actually have to learn the highest. And, like, the two people that play the game, besides me and my homie... Well, actually, my homie—I'm the only one who's actually done the apartment heist on originally on PS3. They—they know they exist, but never have touched them. And it's like, man, y'all are in for a treat. There's Pack uh, standard, yeah. man. There's five of them you have to do. So. Yeah, it's a. Uh, isn't it? Isn't it a? Uh, you have the first one, which is. The first one's easy. <laughs> the first one's very easy. It first one you easy. can do it two people. Prison Break, Humane Labs. 
They're... Well, you've, you've got to complete all the heists with the same crew as part yeah, of the crew. Yeah, that's part of it too. That's just for tier three. Yeah. Which, you know, it's kind of... Uh, that, that, that'll be hard enough as it is, but yeah, tier four, you've actually got to do the criminal mastermind challenge. Yeah, I'm, I'm and looking you've got for to the entire elite. Oh, yeah, so, and then you've got to complete all the elite challenges for each ice. Yep. Whilst earning $50 million. So, and yep. unlock 15 platinum awards. Well, one of those platinum awards is to do all the heists in first person mode, which That'd is be kind fun. of. It's it's not too bad, but driving sucks in first person mode. And that, it has I didn't to be, even it, think about that. Yeah, it has to be first locked person. At the beginning uh, dude, of the first heist. person in GTA is not is not good. Dude, I like first person like fighting, I like do. PvP, shooting and stuff. Yeah. But like when it comes to driving, yeah, the, things, I, things like that. Not, it's not really the best at all. Maybe if they yeah, made the mechanics You've got helicopters, better, you've got cars, like just, and yeah. uh, stuff like that to do in first person. And you have to lock first person. You know, at the menu, you've got an option. Oh, to yeah, you got yeah, to lock it. Yeah, you got to lock it. Yeah, you've actually got to lock it to make it count. And you've got to do all five heists in, per per in first person. You know, that would be a award, fun twist so. to put on, like, the, okay, can we do Criminal Mastermind? Can we do Criminal Mastermind, but first person only? That would be yeah. something that, like, I I actually don't think I've seen someone do that before. Not that I can recall, at least. Um, GTA series did it. Okay. Yeah, on YouTube. So yeah, GTA series did it. I, when I first started. You are going to die. Those. Um, yeah, I uh, watched those. I yeah, he's got a, a big community of people that he can call upon to help. A GTA series. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But he's I, got, he's got like I, a couple I million subscribers and stuff like that. He's got, a, he's got a pretty big Discord too, where people get together. And... I can. I can That's like what I was like trying to do with my Discord at one point, it. but I suck, man. I have horrible vision. I can pull like 20 people that I can practice with and oh, debate who's the best. But like, we had a group, and then one of them like got really stuck into PvP, and it's like, like it, when we're do oh that hurt. When we're doing PvP, like when you're trying to do that heist, you can't be PvPing. Like, you want to primary focus on that because if you're not, then you're not going to learn anything. Then you're going to be you're going to be thinking about when you're going to go and take over a lobby next, and that's just never fun. I know a lot of people that like PvPing, and it's my fault because I put them on PvP originally. Grave, I just watched you fly down that mountain. Yeah, I'm probably going to end this stream and take off for a little bit. Um, got food to eat. That's fair. That's what I'll I was doing as well. Um, so. I got okay. some videos I'm going to make and stuff like that. Take another look at the old career challenge and see. That's why, I like, I've been trying to knock out of, like as much solo stuff as possible before I have to like start yeah, know, I'm on relying on I'm like doing people. All the solo stuff. I do have to ask. Uh, how how long have you been playing the game, Sam? How long? Yeah. Uh, so I'm a returning player from PS3. So. Uh see, I am too, but I didn't get across my account over. I was, I was, I hit the deadline. Yeah, no, I'm um, yeah, a returning player from PS3, so I've got, I guess, all the... Okay. PS3 yeah, no, because I've seen your level, you and I was like, that's nice. <laughs> I've seen yeah, your that's, level, that's all, that's, that's, all, that's all legit, too. I've got... Oh, um, no, I figured it was. I, I duped about $170 million in cars, and I can only assume that, because I've got... If you look at my, my money earned, I've earned $170 million in selling vehicles. And you can see that on the Social Club. I look at mine all the time. Mine's a lot of missions. Yeah, so I've got $170 million in selling cars. And then the rest is from doing heists, businesses, and so on. And I've earned, I think it's just under $2 billion legit in the game after that. That's so. amazing, man. Yeah. Yeah, but There's that's not like from that's from like being able to cross your account, though. Like, this is the same account that you've been playing on for... Like, for three consoles. Yeah, yep. okay. That, yep. That's understandable. Yeah, unfortunately, yep. I missed out on, I think, two of the migrations or something like that, and I, I've restarted you this game. You missed out on uh, you missed I missed out, out on, on a couple that of was, them, I know that. That was from three to, to four. Well, I've I got two other four. accounts. I've got two other accounts that were on three as well. There was some really awesome oh, yeah. glitching that was so, going on at one point, too, because you could, uh, at one point, you could trade your, con your, your basically your account to anything. That's why people were taking PC accounts and, and switching them to console, so you could mod the PC accounts and and then and switch it. them to console, and then you'll have like all this modded stuff on console. 
that yeah, you weren't right, able, yeah. weren't uh, normally I've, able I've, to do. I've which you know, I've... like pe dude, people like that's what's weird up in my mind sometimes too. Like people think that like modded outfits are like the most craziest thing or something like that. And, like, but on PC there's just these menus and you just get to make them. Like you just get to make them for like RP servers and stuff. Like, like the server that I'm running around right now. Like looks almost exactly like my character, and I'm getting in a lot of trouble for it because it doesn't represent a real life character necessarily, and that's why a lot of the admins are like, "You got to change that, or we're gonna ban you." And I'm just like, "Fuck you." <laughs> Although this is my you character can't ban in GTA, me. I'm, I'm not kidding. <laughs> I mean, I'm talking like green joggers, Tron shoes, all that stuff. You just get a you just get a menu to do it, dude. Yeah. Invisible uh, arms, all that stuff, dude. That's why I people are like, you want it, dude. You want to have the better aspect of GTA and all the awesome stuff that you get to do, like. And that's what people ask me all the time, like, dude, just go to PC, dude. It's all on PC, not here on console. Like, trust me. Like, there's not people bringing in Star Wars, freaking, you know, vehicles from Star Wars, because that ain't happening here on console. But you know what, PC, that happens. I've seen it. <laughs> And now they hired, uh, Rockstar hired 5M, the 5M creators, and I think Red M too, right? It wasn't just, it wasn't just 5M. Yeah, I don't know at this point. We just know someone got hired. Yeah, I'm out of here though. You guys have a good one. Uh, thank you for helping. I'll be back after a bit. Probably start up another stream here, or not a stream, but, uh, probably a live stream. I don't know. Who knows? We'll see. Yeah, ping, ping us a message, man, if you if you jump on or whatever, uh, especially if you need a hand with anything. Hey, I'm always willing to Yeah, I'm in. probably, you know, I'd like to switch around, too, for career challenges, so I'm probably going to jump back on and get some videos done or something and then figure out what I'm working on here for the whatever, career man, challenges because totally i got a lot flexible. of stuff potentially to go through. Yeah, I'm totally flexible. If you need a hand, we'll shoot. Right on, man. Know. Appreciate that. Appreciate everybody uh, for the, Take for care, the support everyone. and stuff I'll like that. I sent you a, uh, a friend request as well, other person in yeah, party. I'll get you, man. Right on. Right. Cool, cool. Take care, everyone. All right, man.